leaving. It's free real estate. Yo, Lynx, with the best seat in the house. <laughs> Good morning, Lynx. How are you? Also, the biggest beard right now. Hello Ooh, there. Thing is massive. How are you, man? See, hey. Good morning. Happy Saturday. I thought you'd go out riding your bicycle. In the mountains, man. See the mountains. But you know it's good to have you here, though. PG3, hey, blam, blam, right back at you. <laughs> How are you, new four? Hey, welcome back. How are you? Happy Saturday. Just after. Oh, cool. Nice. What's the weather like? I'm just assuming you guys in the, in the far south right there, you've got, like, summer temperatures right now. I'm sure of it. And I'm so jealous. Perfecto. Hello there. I promised I did the hand thing. Yo, David, hey! Good morning, how are you? Happy Saturday. I hope you're all awake and doing well. I'm not. I mean, I'm doing well, I'm just not awake yet. But the hydrate might help. We're gonna go ahead and do that. It'll be winter again, so- No, Lurky, don't say that! Do not say that to me, that's illegal! Mander, hey, good morning! Or good afternoon. Well, still morning. <laughs> Everybody grab the closest thing you've got to a liquid and have a sip with me, all right? This one goes out to you, David. It's not Monday, David! Cheers! I, I keep holding the, the water bottle up to the camera, so... But you can't see that yet, because I'm hiding behind the curtain! No, man, see, that's an illegal emote! You stop that right now! This is the worst way to wake up in the morning! I hate it! <laughs> All right, let's just get this around the rope, shall we? Let's just do this, shall we? Let's just do this! I've got curtains in the sauna. I don't have a sauna! I don't actually have curtains. God damn it. Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, you know? How, how are you? How are you? Chad, hey, good morning. I hope you know that Mandra, you're not allowed to put no, you're not allowed to put that emote that, that okay, it's gone now. It's fine. Hey, you're doing better. I'm glad to hear that you need curtains, too I'm not a big fan of curtains, you know, what do you call the the you know the the rolly slidey thingies that What do you call those? But I've got those things instead of curtains. I don't know why blinds. There you go. Thank you lurky I've got I've got blinds because it feels like there'd be less spiders hiding in those you know? Yo, Giolano, good morning, how are you? Happy Saturday. It's finally Saturday. And we are back with some Geo Chatter. Um, I thought what we could do today is start out with some Geo Chatter, maybe switch over to some Geo Bingo. I know some of you have been requesting that, you know? And if you guys would like to, to join in on that, in that, you can just play some Geo Chatter with me. Exclamation mark GC and chat is all you need to do. You're trying to behave new for, you're doing a great job at it. I haven't seen you put a single illegal emote in chat, and I appreciate you for that, you know? You're my favorite chatter. So, there you go. Alright, we're gonna start out with five two-minute rounds of ACW to start out. If you're wondering, if you're wondering why, let me show you, why we've switched to ACW. ADW is now officially unmaintained. Alright? So we get- No, man, see, that is an illegal emote! You stop that right now! And don't decol on me, man, or that's- No! You know I'm right. You know I'm right. Here we go. Let's get this show on the road. David, that's still illegal. You stop that. You just heard me say it. Ooh. This is the worst way to wake up. Just wait for the leaderboard. Leaderboard? Hey, hello? Leaderboard? There we go. All right. Two minutes on the clock. I'll do the moving. You do the guessing. All right. We'll start out with some yellow dividing. Ooh, this is nice. Nice! There is an... Esso? Uh, uh, is that what you, you, you call them Essos, right? They're right there. If you do exclamation mark GC in chat new for you'll get the link off of there. Uh, and, and you can also use the extension if you hover the video right here. Right about there you'll find a little icon which will let you guess without even leaving the site. 
There's a little bit of language right there. Where's the sun? Ooh, good question. It's right there. It's to the south of us. Which means we are in the northern hemisphere, like north of this line, right? Wait, you got a chocolate from under it to took you to the dark side of sun? No, that's not a thing, Lynx! It is not a thing! There's no Zona. There never was! Mander's gonna be the first one on the board and the first one to get it right! Let's go! Not the first one on the board, but the first one to definitely get it right. Maybe your ad blocker is blocking that? Oh, shoot. That might be the case. Um, I mean, I run a lot of content blockers in general, and I have, I ha I have to disable all of them, basically, to play. It's... That's a me thing. Never take chocolate from Andrew unless you want to have a space trip. We're blasting off! Let's go! Uh, let me know if there's anything you need me to zoom in on because I don't know. That hurts? What do you mean, David? What? What, what do you mean? What? Uh, what else do we have, huh? Not a lot. I mean, the little bit of language that I can see is right here, right? It doesn't quite look English to me. It might not be. It might not even be English, you know? What if it isn't? Time is up right here as well, it seems like, so it's my turn. To turn off the blockers, that does hurt. Yes, it does. But I basically break the internet every single time I open a new site. I gotta allow, like... One thing by one thing until it finally works and I can read whatever I'm looking to read. It's an issue. But it's fine. Alright, we're closing out the guests. You thought you accidentally opened Perfect Drugs Locker this morning? But you guess it was Manders' chocolate. <laughs> nice. I want, I've never had that before. You know, I've had chocolate. But not the space type kind of chocolate. All right, I'm just gonna go for a Mexico guess right here because we're in the Northern Hemisphere, right? Generation four camera. And we've got that yellow dividing line. It's the warm-up round. I'm not allergic, I, you, you'd think so, but I'm not. <laughs> I'm, I'm definitely not. There we go, and it wasn't, it was Canada? What? But, but the language. But the language, was that French? There's no way. What did I miss? Well done! Mander is going to be the closest one at 1,251 kilometers. Links in second at 16.42. And we've got David in third place at 17.36. Gio Lanner, though, in fourth place. The second of only two to get it right. We've got Mancy up there as well. Myself and my baby boy, the Dare Spot. Esso is a Canadian gas station. I did not know that. We've got them over here as well. I, I did, didn't occur to me to think about like where you find oh are all the gas station in mexico the uh, the oxo brand right gas station meta let's go that's the best smelling meta round number two here we go yo amibio good morning happy saturday hope you're doing all right notice that i haven't mislabeled the day at all yet it's all been saturday all day it's P.E. Max in Mexico. Oh, yeah. Wait, where's the, where's the... What's the OXO thing? Was that Argentina? It's like the OXXO, right? I've seen those, but... I can't remember where. You feel much better today? I'm glad to hear that, Amivio. I really am. Hopefully, the weekend is just gonna keep getting better. Oh, it's a food store. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Energy drink for Mancy. I love it. I love that. You drink them. Is that a white metal? It might be, or it could just be extremely overexposed. No, it's white. It's definitely white. Also, concrete slabs. Ayushi is the first one on the board and the first one to get it right! Welcome back, Ayushi. I missed you. How are you? We've got a lot of palm trees in the distance. Can we figure out which side of the road we're driving on? I feel like that's going to be super important. That's a brake light. We might be driving on the right-hand side of the road right here. Link's got it as well. Nicely done. Giolano as well. This is a slightly tricky one. You're learning Twitch and YouTube documentation on Python? Nice. That's cool. I did a couple of Python courses. I don't know what I'm doing. But it's fun. And interesting. 
How do you find it so far? 10 second warning by the way, if you haven't made your guess by then, it'll be too late. I feel like we are probably driving on the right hand side of the road, right? And with a concrete slabbage, there is concrete slabbage. All right, here we go. I think that all should mean that we're probably in the Philippines. We're going north of Manila like always. Right up here, it's gotta be that one day, you know? How do you rate when you've had your first live stream? Well, like, when did I do that? It was the 16th of December, 2021. Was it? Yeah, it was. It's been a while. The white space thing messes you up on Python? Wait, what is... Oh yeah, I think I... Wait, what? what is that actually? Boom, look at that, it was the Philippines! Ayushi in the lead at 308 kilometers, Lynx in second at 346, and I'll take third at 394. Mansi got it as well, Mander, Giolano, David, and my baby boy, the Darisbot, as well as Amevio. Nicely done, round number three. So ACW's kinda, it's doable, right? A little bit of language right here. I'm gonna look around some more. Where's the sun at? I'm gonna assume it's right there to the south of us. So we're definitely in the northern hemisphere, north of this line, right? You use indentations instead of, or for code blocks instead of the, oh yeah. Oh yeah, wait. Not always though, it could, it's a list thing or something. I can't remember. It, uh, it's been a while. It's been like a year at least. All right, we're driving on the right-hand side of the road. There is a bus, and there's a little bollard hiding. A yellow bollard hiding in the shadow of the bus. Here's more of them. If it helps, Amivio got it right. The first one on the board, nicely done. Can we look at the city names again? Absolutely, they look like this. Fifty seconds remaining. It's a beautiful landscape too, right? I like it. Skull hole! Yep. You raise your glasses. <laughs> also this one. Link's got it right as well. Nicely done. Half a minute remains. There's no roof rack on the car, by the way, if you're wondering. Stop being so selfless. I'll be as selfless as I wanna. It's my home. I can be as selfless as I want to. Come into my home and tell me how to live my life. There's also these ones. Show you the sign skin. All right, there you go. You got 10 seconds though. Not a lot of time to work with. You found one of the Mander. Let's go. And I'm guessing these might be kilometers, right? Could be helpful. Time is up, and we're closing out the guesses. So, I mean, I kind of recognize parts of the language, right? But I'm going to go with a quick guess right here. We're going Iceland because the bollards fit. I'm not going to spend too long trying to find it. Let me just try to find one. Oh, reopen? Oh, shoot, you're technically a little bit late. We're normally pretty strict about reopening, but I'll, I'll you know, it's your first day back in a while. I'll make an exception just this once, right? But you've got to do it quickly. you got to be quick. There you go. Nicely done. All right. Uh, oof, I don't know. I'm just going to, I'm just going to do this. There we go. Let's send it and find out. Boom! Giolano's gonna be the closest one with a 5k! A round of applause! Six meters away, David in second at 11, and Ayushi in third with 20 meters! We're gonna zoom in and have a look at this one. Look at that, you're all right on top of us. Or it. Well done. Yo, man, she made it in as well. We've got Lynx in fourth place. Manders up the Remivio, myself, Mansi, and my baby boy, the Darisbot, goes to Lichtenstein. Darisbot. Why? Why, why are you like this? All right, round number four. Here we go! Black vehicle underneath us immediately. Let's see, the sun is to the... Uh, kind of hard to tell, right? Slightly north, maybe? You think you know this one? Let's go! Dark Spot is confused, yeah. He's a bit stupid like that sometimes, you know? He's... He does his best. 
Yellow dividing line right here as well. You'll try the matter, go for it! This version has flags for the country each people, I guess? Uh, technically, but these are the, if you're referring to these ones, right? Uh, these are the ones uh, that people have chosen, so you can represent your own country or region even. But there is a way, I think there's a way to uh, actually show the guesses too. I just, I normally, you know, turn those off because it'll be kind of spoilery. Where's the sun again? Uh, also, hey, Grass Jazz, how are you? The sun is right there. You've got a little compass right here next to me. I'd say that's slightly north of us, right? Oh, you did notice that? Yeah, on the on the guesses at the at the end of the round. Yeah, they will show. So uh, you'll notice that you can you can't really tell a lot off of the scoreboard right here, but it'll show at the end definitely. All right, half a minute remains. Again, there is a black vehicle underneath us. A yellow dividing line. The sun. I mean, oh wait. All right. Uh, the sun should indicate that we're either in the southern hemisphere, or we are. Maybe equatorial, right? I don't recognize these ones. Do you? I don't! Wait, I do! I recognize the top of these ones. But I don't recognize these. Oh no! I might not get it. Five, oh, two seconds remaining. Uh oh. Uh oh! Well, it's my turn. We're closing out the guests. And this time. You know the black car. I'm gonna. I'm gonna not trust the sun, right? You should never trust the sun. She's up there scheming. Um, should probably leave us in Argentina, right? Especially with these ones, like the tops of these. They've got this neat kind of shape to them. It's a street killer! Oh no! Giolano is so far the only one to get it right. Let's see if I can join in the gang. We're going Argentina. No! It was Peru. There's no way. Can I see a round of applause for Giolano right there? Well done. The only remaining survivor. A streak of four. Links in second place at 9.30 though. That's close. We've got Mansi up there in third at 14.22. Myself in fourth. Mandra, David, Grass Chess. We've got a Mevio there too. My baby boy, the dire spot, goes to Bahrain. And we've got Ayushi up there as well. That was a clever one, Ayushi, though. I could definitely see that being the UAE. Nicely done. How did you get it, Giolano? Nicely done. Round number five is coming up. The fifth round of the warm-ups right here. Two minutes on the clock. You saw tiny rifts. Is that a thing? I've never even seen those, I think. There you go, Grass Jones. If you do flag packs as well, you'll see all the ones that I've enabled. I basically enabled every single one, and you can do quite a few different flags. Oh, you sometimes find tiny rifts in UAE? I don't think I've noticed those. That's kind of cool. You've got an insane vibe guess right here. Let's go. Go for it. Trust your gut. Trust your... Uh, are these flags? I'm just asking because they're colorful. And we're seemingly driving on the left-hand side of the road. Single yellow dividing line. Beer metal? Mm. One minute remains. I don't even know where the sun is. It's very overcast. Maybe this one. It's to the south of us, if that's the case. Was that a bush? Ooh. Could be. Could be. I don't recognize it. Can I zoom on the pole? Absolutely. Uh, we've got a couple right here. I think there's another one right here, right? This one. This can definitely be region guess. How? No, but how? It looks tricky. It's super tricky. 1664 beer? That's so old. Probably gonna taste horrible. The pole top of the three insulators. Wait. That one, right? It's this one. The yellow line kind of worries you. I get that. I mean, I'm worried all over. I have no idea with this one. 10 seconds remaining, though. You've seen this road? Ooh. I mean, maybe it's on a, you know, the other side of a, the other side of a uh, border or something. I know where this is. I do not, Lings. I'm sorry. I don't. I really don't. I honestly don't. Here's my thinking, though, right? 
Driving on the left-hand side of the road, the vegetation to me looks like we, we might be Southeast Asia right here. And I'm gonna... I'm just gonna assume those country colors right there match up. We're gonna go Indonesia. It's not gonna work out for me, but I'll do it anyway. Wait, the flags pa page doesn't work? Oh, shoot. I did not know that. Does flag packs, though, if you do... Let me see. Flag packs. Does that one work? Hopefully that one works. Yo, Cosmo B, good morning. How are you? Happy Saturday. The Indonesian flag gave it away. I hope that's the case. And it was! Geo Lunar did it best at 455 kilometers away. I'll take second place at 1749 and Lynx in third at 2284. Oh, the links don't work? Oh, shoot. I'll, um... I'll look into that. I don't know how much I can do, but you can use uh, country codes or you could use country names. And there should be a bunch of other ones as well in there. We've got David in fourth place here, though. Man, see, are you see Mandarin, Mivio, and Grass Chest? A bit of a spread on this one, but we're all in that same region. You did well. Wait, check where you guessed. Are you see you right here? Oh, Bhutan. So if I click this one, right, we can bring up your guests. That is the power of GeoChat right here. Look at that. I, yeah, good guessing. I like it. We won't be able to play much. Got some work to do. Not a problem, Cosmo B. I'm honored that you'd like to spend your time over here with us. There we go. The warm-ups are done. And Geo Loner is your winner of the warm-ups. Nicely done. 50, 65 kilometers in total for Geo Loner. 17,602 point score. And a streak of five. Not a single country wrong. Nicely done. Someone's already done with the warm-ups. We've got Lynx in second at 5204. And Mandarin third place at 8086. Really nicely done. I'll take fourth. We got Mansi up there as well. David, Ayushi, and Mevio. My baby boy, the Dara Spot. And Grass Chest. Nicely done. We are going to go again. And if you want to join in and play with us, exclamation mark GC in chat is all you need to do. Wait, the map isn't showing? Is that on the web page or is it on the uh, extension? It, it should still be. No, I, I misclicked. By That's habits. Old habits. See, there we go. Oh, the clap emote. So the clap emote is part of 7TV, so you'll see a lot of those up here above me. Uh, if you don't have 7TV um, enabled, you'll just see a bunch of weird words and stuff like that. But it'll show up here, or if you install the 7TV emote. So, no, not that one, man. See, that's an illegal one. You don't put that emote in chat. That is illegal. All right, here we go. Five two-minute rounds of ACW this time. Here we go. No, Mander, you no, you're not allowed to. You're a mod. You know the rules. David and Lake. Oh, look at that. It's illegal, guys. You're being very rude right now. And I don't appreciate it. All right, here we go. Immediately with a bunch of birch right here in front of us. That's a little bit of a tip-off to me. An unbroken outer line. You would like to install that? Uh, if you do exclamation mark 7TV in chat, you'll get the link to uh, install the extension if you want it. You know, otherwise you can just look right here and you'll see them. All right, one minute and a half remains right here. No guesses on the board yet. Um, I don't, I don't want to give this one away. I mean, I'm not even sure I'm right. But um, hmm, what can I say that would be slightly... It's a slight hint, right? Language would be helpful, is, is what I will say. Maybe. Uh, look down the car color. It looks silver or white. Looks like a couple of countries. Yes, you're not wrong. Uh, but I do believe with the white dividing line and the unbroken outer line, that might be a little bit of a hint. On a road like this, anyway. Again, I could definitely be wrong here, though. So we'll find out soon. 50 seconds from now. Mansi, going for a coffee. Bring me one, please, Mansi. I need a coffee. Oh, I would give anything for a coffee right now. Geo Lunner's the first one to get it right. Let's go. Ooh, who's playing that saxophone, huh? Sounds nice. Half a minute. Again, a lot of birch. Which... You know, could be a bit of a hint. 
It's the epic sax guy. I love him. I love him. Here we go. 10 seconds. Only Geo Lawler so far. This one might be trickier than I thought. Oh, no. Huh. I don't, I don't understand the question, Amibio. How hard is it to do YouTube? I, I've never done it, so I, I wouldn't know. Uh, I only ever upload my VODs to there. Grass chest with the follow. Thank you. I appreciate that. And the flag did work. What flag is that? None of it. Nice. That's in Canada, isn't it? Awesome. All right. Closing out the guesses, and I'll give this one a shot. I was thinking Finland this whole time. I mean, going off the scoreboard meta, though, I could be wrong, but we'll give it a shot. Here we go. How hard is it to stream in a sauna? I don't stream in a sauna, David! It was Sweden. How is it Sweden? How is it Sweden? You can't just do that to me, Sweden! You ah! Joe Lanner was not fooled, though, at 342 kilometers. How? Genuinely how on this one? What? None of the metas checked out. So, oh shoot. Mancy in second place at 428, and I'll take third at 445. We've got Mander up there in fourth place. Crash Jazz, we've got David, Lynx, Cosmo, B, Amivio, and my baby boy, the Darisbot, goes to South Sudan this time. Let's go, Darisbot. Round number two. You've never seen that same, genuinely ever. The road markings didn't check out. Not even a little bit. And I'm not going to call David out for that. <laughs> I mean, I've done that to Norway a bunch of times as well, right? Just straight up get it wrong. Um, I'm going to assume that's the sun. It's setting to the southwest of us. There were some sort of outer dashes, and that white car with a long antenna is much more common in Sweden than Finland. Look at Jolana pulling out all the stops. I love it. I love it. All right, see, now this suddenly got tricky. Does the car have a hue? Ooh, good thinking. Uh, it doesn't look like it, but it does have a bit of a antenna with a seemingly a piece of tape on it. I can't see a hue at all. I think I know what you're looking for, but I, I can't see it. I've got a singular piece of meadow that I'll be leaning on this round. Not sure I'll get it though. One minute remains. It is pretty flat, but there's some mountains maybe behind these. What are these? They're not reeds, they're trees. You talk to the Swedish road workers and fix that line better. You better do that, David. I'm holding you responsible. I'm hold fix your country right now. <laughs> I will not stand for that. All right. Uh, about a half a minute remains right here. Beautiful cloud coverage though, right? Finally, the poor road quality helped. Wait a minute, this is Belgium? No. <laughs> 20 seconds. Mancy got it right, the first one to do so. I'm on a 50-50 track right here, all right? I've got a couple of metas that might help me out. Less than five seconds now. If you haven't made a guess by then, it'll be too late. Geo Lauder, no, the streak ends there. Then again, you have the skill to rebuild that streak, and I have the technology. We'll do it together. You love that Belgium is everyone's little brother they make fun of. Yeah, but it's the little brother that brings delicious chocolate and waffles. So I'm all right with that. You know? It's all done in love. All right. Caro with the coffee! Speaking of... Mm. Oh, thank you, Caro. How are you? Good morning. All right, so here's my meta for this one. Uh, this is what I believe is called autumnal coverage. I mean, that's what I call it. Notice how it's all autumn? Everything is wilted. It's all brown. That's going to leave us with a guess of Bulgaria or Hungary. Now, this is flat. And also Mansi got it, right? So I'm going to use the Mansi meta on this one and go hungry. Right here. Imagine if this works out. Imagine if it does. Here we go. And it did! Let's go! 60 kilometers away from me! Mancy in second at 83 and Mancy... No, wait, David... Did I say Mancy twice? David in second place at 83 and Mancy in third at 124! No, get that sus chicken out of here! I love him, but he's... Uh, you don't be... You don't be... 
<laughs> Mandarin Fort Place, Crash Chest is up there as well. Cosmo B, Giolana, Amivio, and Lynx. The sausage is even worse, David. Get him away from me. All right, here we go. Round number three. Three. And immediately we've got a roof rack on our hands. It's a roof rack without a rubber inlay, if that helps. The sun is right there to the south of us. We're definitely in the northern hemisphere, north of this line. And also, there's some traffic. A little bit of traffic. I'll just subtly point out th the traffic. That's a neat truck behind us, right? A little bit. It's kind of cool. I want it. How long was needed for me to become better in geography games? It took me a long time. The, the only cool, my only kind of claim to fame with that is that everything that I know, I've learned off of you guys in chat. I, I mean, I've opened some of those uh, meta websites, but I've never used them. So I've learned everything from you, which is kind of cool. Check the Discord. What's going on in the Discord? Lurky, you delete that post right now or you'll be in trouble! What is that? God damn it, I'm saving it. That's the worst thing I've ever seen! That's so rude! <laughs> that's, that's so how? What are you? No! What? No! I don't like it! Not at all! That, I will not stand for this! <laughs> God damn it! That's the worst thing! No, delete that! How do I delete someone else's post? <laughs> God damn it. Alright, 20 seconds remaining. Again, we've got a couple. Can we import it to here? Oh, don't you worry, I'll do that. That is the thing I'll do. And I only do that because, you know, I gotta honor our artists. So, whatever you guys make, I'll have to implement. But... Damn it. I hate it. Thank you, Lurky. That's very... Something. <laughs> you remember in school times you had geography lessons and sometimes needed to know where different countries are and s the seas and rivers. That is tricky. I would not be able to show you a single river, I think. Not even... No, none of them, actually. All right, time is up and it is my turn. See, that's the thing. I'm really bad at geography. I only know the things based off of GeoGuessr, honestly. Which is kind of why I like GeoGuessr, because I got to learn a lot. Um, this is not my favorite meta, though. God damn it. God damn it! Legs, now I can't see anything! But this blurry shape right here is a cop car, um, which you'll find a lot in Nigeria. So we'll do that. David with the hydrate. We're gonna do that! Look at that! Lynx with the win at 96 kilometers! Giolano in second at 100, and myself in third at, what is that, 285 kilometers. Nicely done. Everybody grab the closest thing you've got to a liquid and have a sip with me. This one goes out to you, David! Cheers. There we go. All right. You need more water? You do need more water, Lurky. Go for it. All right, round number five, uh, no, uh, not, oh, grass just in fourth place. We've got Sophia as well. Welcome back, Sophia. Nancy, we got David, Cosmo, B, Caro, Mandor, and Mevio, and my baby boy, the Darsbot, goes to Germany. Oh, he misses Vav. He misses Vav, and he went to Germany looking for Vav. All right, cool. Round number four, here we go. Nancy now with the biggest bit in the channel, ripping it off the face of Lynx. That's a nice looking beard, Mancy. You keep all you keep on to that, right? Keep holding on to that. Okay, so yellow outer lines on this one. The sun is to the north of us, so we know we're in the southern hemisphere. And I don't know if uh, these are a meta in this country. I'm not entirely sure. And we're driving on the left. Good call. Good shout. Also, there's a couple of red and white chevrons. Mountains all of my uh, well actually mountains mostly to the southwest of us Let's see anything else at all. <gasps> There's Mancy. I Can't count I can definitely count David. I definitely know how to count. I Can count to like a hundred all right, so That is Mancy. I think you're right. 
I think you're right. Why did that brass sound like a Rickroll? Wait, which one? What, what, which one? Which one? What? We don't, we don't Rickroll here. We do that's not a thing we do. Uh, <laughs> look at the sun, it's to the north of us. Oh, the Trump is in sex kind of thing. Oh, I didn't even notice that. I hate it. <laughs> All right. Time is quickly running out. Half a minute remains. Again, yellow outer lines driving on the left-hand side of the road. Um, generation 4 camera. And the sun is to the north of us. We're in the southern hemisphere, right? Yo, zombie! How am I doing? I'm doing great. How are you? Welcome back. Happy Saturday. I'm doing good. I mean, still work. You're still working on waking up. But I'm getting there, you know? How are you? Time is up in this round, and it is my turn. So, this time, there is a non-zero chance that I'll get it wrong, especially with the Gen 4, but I believe we're gonna be in South Africa. We'll go close to Lesotho, though, because of the, the mountains, right? Here we go. And it was! I was kind of off, but still. Mandra wasn't though at 265 kilometers! David in second place at 316, and myself in third at 509. Geo Lunner's up there as well, rebuilding that streak. Now at a streak of two. Sophia as well. We got Cosmo B, Man, Steve Caro, Emivio, Grass Chest, Lynx, and my baby boy, the Darsbot. Nicely done, Mandra. That was a good one. Round. We're no strangers to love. You know the rules. And so do I. Do I? A full commitment's what I'm thinking of. You wouldn't get this from any other guy. I just want to tell you how I'm feeling. Got to make you understand. Never going to give you up. Never going to let you down. Never going to run around and desert you. Never going to make you cry. Never going to say goodbye. Never going to tell a lie and hurt you. That's not my voice. I never said that, Link. Thank you. But God damn it. That's not me. That was not me. I hate this. <laughs> I hate it. I hate it so much! But thank you, Lynx, I appreciate it. But I also never do that again! All right, there we go. Next one up is round number five. Here we go! It's the worst. It's the worst! All right, what do we got here? Yellow dividing lines. A black vehicle. The sun is... Oh, it threw me off! The sun is to the north of us. We're in the southern hemisphere. I think I know this one. I believe I might. Also, I did just... I, we do not rickroll people in this channel! Especially me! <laughs> Using my own voice to rickroll me, that's so rude! I can't believe you've done this! Where are... Where, what else do I zoom in on? There's nothing! I don't trust this one at all. At all. Mancy's gonna be the first one to get it right. Cosmo and Sophia did as well. Nicely done. Can I zoom into the southwest at the end of the road? Absolutely. That was this one, right? One, two, buckle my shoe. Three, four, buckle some more. Five, six, Nike kicks. Thank you, Lynx. What was that? No, what was that? <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Did you just run a Nike ad on me? You know, I'm all right with that, but, you know, what? <laughs> Half a minute rains. I don't know what's going on anymore. I've lost control. The stream is in shambles. <laughs> it's too early for this. I have no idea where we're at right here, by the way. Like, none. Not even a little bit. At least the music's soft. Five seconds remaining. There is a hint of a mountain over there. I'll just go with my gut. So, black vehicle, southern hemisphere, yellow dividing line. I think we're gonna be in Argentina. It's gotta be Argentina at some point, right? No, don't you laugh at me! Don't you laugh at me! No, you stop laughing right now! No, that, no, I hate that. I hate that, Lynx! You stop that! You stop that right now! <laughs> Thank you, though. It was Argentina! My God, it checked out. 
Sophia did it better though. 126 kilometers. I'll take second at 667. And Mandarin third place at 923. Mansi's out there as well in fourth place. Giolano Grass Chest. Carl Cross Mount P. Links, my baby boy. Go swimming off the coast. In the Gulf of Mexico. Nice. Is that is this water is this warm water? I I'd assume it would be, right? We've got Amivio up there as well, and David, nicely done. Round number five is up, but we are going to go again. Before we do, though, give it up for your winner, because it's none other than me. No, you got, no, you got to applaud. You got, I did well, Chad, come on. I don't deserve this. It's not cheating. Get that pink starfish man away from me. I hate him. I hate him so much! 1968 kilometers in total and 20,343 point score. Giolano though in second place! A streak of three! 2488 kilometers in total and Mander in third place at 3094! Nicely done! We've got Mancy up there as well, David, Cosmo, B, Grass, Chest, Sophia, Lynx, Amivio, Caro, and my baby boy, the Darius Bot! Nicely done! You would like this geography play every day to train brains and memory, right? Uh, there are a couple of free alternatives, I believe. But I mean, I stream every day. It's that's a thing you could do, you know. <laughs> We're gonna go again. And if you want to join in and play with us, exclamation mark GC in chat is all you need to do. And also, feel free to let me know if there are maps you'd like to try out. Uh, I can't promise you that we'll do every single one, but I'm open for the occasional suggestion, right? Also, I love kind of getting to learn ACW now after all that time playing ADW. Are you ready? Wait a minute! Now the biddies! Now the biddies! Thank you, Lynx! I'm assuming that was Lynx. It was Lynx! Thank you! <laughs> I appreciate that. That is one of my... The bit alerts that I use. There we go. Five, two, minute round starts right now! Oh, 2069 says man. See, I just noticed that. We're going... We're doing it. I like that one. We're doing it. Geo Guesser in 2069. Nice. And if you've never played this one before, um, well, what's the one where people walk around with camps? Do you like like the outside ones? Do you mean like the uh, like the streaming category? It's IRL streams. So this is. Yo, Mansi with the lurker tags. Thank you. Uh, if you've never played this map before, uh, have you ever wondered what it would be like if every country in the world had Street View and Car Meta didn't exist? Well, look no further. This map includes 1,007 photosphere locations. Photospheres, mind you. It's, uh, in 186 countries and 15 territories around the world. All photospheres are taken on a road to resemble official Street View. Uh, feeling. Due to the nature of photospheres, it is advised to play no move pan or zoom, so that is what we'll do. Are you ready, chat? Five two minute rounds of Geogaster in 2069! What was that? That's a, that's a big puppy! That is a big puppy! Thank you, Lynx. I'm scared. I'm very scared. Thank you. All right, here we go. Five, two minute rounds. It'll be no move, pan, or zoom. Are you ready? There we go. So keep in mind, these might not be official coverage. I mean, they are not official coverage. So it's, it's dark. It's dark. The future, it's nowhere to be seen. Did we just predict the future right here? Live on stream. We might have. I'm going to try a refresh. It worked last time. Oh no, hopefully that's not a sign of things to come. Oh no, the future ends with us, chat. No, it doesn't. We'll be fine, chat. We will be fine. Don't even worry about it. Here we go. Anyone know black metal? I know black metal. That's about it. Here we go. I'm going to duck down to show you there's nothing hiding behind me, all right? Because I'm that kind of good guy. And I wouldn't hide anything from you. Nothing. Just a weed. Oh, no, that's weed. Uh, get it away from me. Uh, no, 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 no. It's scary. It's scary. It's spoopy. Have you ever had a dream that that you um you had you 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 could you do you you want you you could come on spit it out. 
<laughs> Thank you, Lex. I love that one. Yo, Aaron. Good morning. How are you? Can I rotate? This is no move, pan, or zoom, so I can I can't do anything. I can do nothing. So this is all you've got. A singular picture. And keep in mind, it's not necessarily uh, official coverage, so this can be anywhere in the world. Go with your gut. Yo, Kelly, good morning. How are you? Hello! I hope you're doing all right. Happy Saturday. Are we doing Joe Bingo? I think we might. It's on the docket, as they say. You know, it's up to you guys, though. All right, 10 second warning. If you haven't made a guess by then, it'll be too late. I have no idea. This one's gonna throw me. This one's gonna throw me back. Yo, Pow! How are you? What was that? What? No, no, Link. No, you no know spoilers. No spoilers, Link. You know that. All right, here we go. Time is up. It is my turn. No one's gotten it right. Oh no, this is so hard. Can we trust the compass? I'm gonna assume no, because they're all photospheres, right? GeoGuessr 2069. Nice. Now, see, here's the thing. It looks European. Ha! <laughs> European. Um. I have no idea. I don't think it's Europe. The shadows are casting this way, which would be north of us, kinda. So I'm gonna assume we're in the southern hemisphere. I know I said we couldn't probably trust the sun, but I'm gonna do it anyway. You'll be participating in a Marvel TV and let's I'm go! I'm in Amsterdam, which is without a doubt the cannabis capital of the world. Y yeah, you're not wrong, Lynx, you know? It's, you're not wrong. I'm going, I'm going, Chad. I'm going, Chad, right here. Look at this. Oh, come on! It was Granada! Granada! Geolunner, it's gonna be the closest one at 696 kilometers. Nicely done, that's a swim away. That is a literal, like, two hours of swimming away. Nicely done. Grass chest in second of 1538, and we've got clockwise. Welcome back at 2229. Mancy's up there in fourth place. Sophia as well. Myself, Lynx, Amivio, David, Mander, my baby boy, the Darusbot goes. Off the coast of Japan. We got Cosmo B and Lacaro up there as well. This is so hard. The next one up is... This one. And like like last time, I'll duck down to show you there's nothing behind me. See? Nothing! Nothing! You see more weed? Oh no! It seems like it's a... Yo, legs coming in with the pity! Thank you, I appreciate that. It seems like in the future, all the weed has been legalized. But it's not right now in 2020. What is it? Three? 2023. The future looks bright, though. Uh, what do we got? I mean, you can see the satellite dish right there, right? Don't they normally point to a certain area of the sky? I don't know how that works. But it might help you. There is air conditioning. Uh, a couple of these ones. And, uh, this one. It's like triangular shape. Some interesting, you know, um, these ones, you know. What's my favorite country to live in for the future? I have no idea. I've been thinking about that. I mean, I've always been hoping that, um... Africa is going to rise up at some point, right? And just become a superpower? I think that would be amazing. I could see that, you know? They've got they've got it all. They've got resources. They've got amazing cultures. They've got so many things going for them. So hopefully at some point, they're going to take over. Because, I mean, Norway is not the place to be. I can tell you that for free. Five seconds remaining. If you haven't made a guess by then, it'll be too late! I have no idea what this is. Yours would be Colombia? Plenty of white Christmases. No, you're not allowed to say that. <laughs> South Africa isn't as hot. Oh, good point. Good point. Why wouldn't Norway be the place to be? It's so cold! There's snow and it's cold and it's expensive and I don't like it. Get me out of here. <laughs> All right, time is up. 
It is my turn. And we will be going with a guess. Again, no idea. Could be anywhere. But going off of vibes, you know what? I've seen these before and they remind me of Russia. We're gonna go like way out here. Way out here. I know I shouldn't trust the normal meadows, but I'm doing it anyway. You'll say cold though? Oh, I could definitely do with the opposite. <laughs> That's me though. Look at Kara with the win! Got the country right and everything. The only one to do so. A round of applause for Kara! Nicely done. 149 kilometers away. That is genuinely amazing. Cosmo be in second at 430. And we got G DJ Clockwise in third place at 476. Aaron's up there in fourth place. Mandor as well. We got Lynx, Joe Lunner, Mancy, Hakala too. And if you I see David. Our, uh, our, oh, our man's back. Hey, welcome back. Happy Saturday. Sophia too. We got Grass Chest, myself, my baby boy, the Dara Spot goes to Canada. In the Yukon, outside of Mayo! That's disgusting! Uh, we got Pow up there as well, nicely done. Round number three of GeoGuessr in 2069. No move pan or zoom. I don't trust this. But you know what? I think I'll do it anyway. I'll duck down to show you there's nothing behind me. You get all the seasons and the warm ones are for you the most painful. I could see that though. Can I ask whereabouts you live? Because I'm guessing your summers are probably quite a lot more brutal than, than mine are. Where was the previous one? It was uh, Ukraine, believe it or not. Midwestern US, let's go. Oh, I could see that being, you know, quite painful then. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. But. The winters are so brutal, though. There's so much snow, and I don't like it. Arsman got it right. Let's go. Pow got it as well up there. Beautifully done. This one's going to be tricky, isn't it? One minute remains. It's a weird 50-50. I mean, there's some things to go off of, right? There's a yellow plate on the back. Uh, some sort of blue plate on these two, which I've never seen before. People are definitely predicting 2069, yeah. It's a nice year. Oh, the bug start ca Oh, yeah, true. You guys also probably get a lot bigger bugs than we do over here. Like, and I'm not a huge fan of bugs at all. Literally the only reason I haven't been to Australia yet. I do not like them. At all. Like, actual phobia. Like, actual... It'll sh my brain shuts down if I see one. If I scroll past one, yep, nope, no, nope, nope, don't like that. All right, 10 second warning. Some of you gotten this one right and I don't know how. We do have some concrete slabbage, you know, which could help. Going off of the parking jobs, we, ah, uh, you know, should indicate that we're driving on the right hand side of the road, except for this one. Genuinely don't know. I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna choose not to take heed of that. All right, here we go. So, I think we're down here. I think we're down here somewhere. I think I'm thinking probably. I'm just gonna go Hong Kong. I know we've got official coverage right there right now, but still, the yellow backplate, right? Let's give it a shot. You hate flies and you hate flies and musicals. Man, see, musicals are awesome. All right, here we go. Send it and find out. There we go. I got a country right. I'm excited. Sophia, though, is super close at 285 kilometers. Ours man in second at 595. And we've got Kella in third place at 982. And it was right here, if you're wondering. In, uh... Uh, Jinji, I guess is how you pronounce that. Fourth place goes to David. Mancy's out there as well. Pow! Cosmo B! Myself, Geolon or Caro. I see DJ Clockwise out there. Lynx, Aaron, Mander, Crash Chest, Amivio, and my baby boy, the Dara Spot, goes to the US this time. Right in the middle of Texas! Let's go! The Lone Star State! Yeah! Oh, Dara Spot misses Nat. That's cute. Round number four, here we go! 
By the way, there's a call out from Kirei in the Discord. Do we have anyone here who's a Japanese reader or speaker that could help Kirei out? Just thought I'd forward the request. Just in case, you know, just in case. This is what you've got to work with. I'm ducking down again, showing you there's nothing hiding. Nothing up my sleeves. Sadly, you can barely speak English. No, thanks, that's a lie. That's a lie, you know it. All right, there we go. Nothing here. This one's going to get interesting. Yes, it is. I hid the weed. No, I didn't. You can't prove anything. There's a little bit of architecture on the right-hand side. Uh, never seen these utility poles. Super hard. Other than that, a little bit of vegetation could, could tip you off a little bit. Three guesses thusly on the leaderboard, and no one's gotten it right so far. Could this be the street killer we've all feared? Yes. Yes, it can. 45 seconds. More guesses on the board. Where could this possibly be? Half a minute. You would like to learn things with telepathy? I would love to learn telepathy. That would be cool. That would be a cool superpower. Actually, I don't know if I would. If I could elect whether or not to read people's minds, at least. Because I don't want to hear what random people on the streets are saying. That would be horrible. Here we go, 10 seconds remaining right here. We're gonna learn the trombone, but you blew your chances, Link! I hate it! I hate it, but thank you. <laughs> Time is up right here, and it is my turn. You set the last round by accident! No, Giolana, I'm sorry! Wait, normally it stops you from doing that. Normally it stops you from doing that. I don't know why. Well, you know, it might still work. Might work out in your favor, we'll find out. Um, again, I have no idea. None. It could be... Could be around here. It could be Africa. I feel like it could be anywhere. Oh, clicking on the new spot. Oh, yeah. You know what? The architecture of this makes me think we're probably still out here somewhere. I'm going to Vietnam. Here we go! And look at that! I got it right and the crowd goes wild! No, you go goes wild. Go wild in the gun set set, come on! 180 kilometers away! We've got Lynx in second place at 310 kilometers though, and DJ Clockwise in third place at 530. No, get the sausage out of here! Get the sausage out of my face, David! Nicely done, though. Caro's up there as well. We got Amivio, Sophia, Cosmo, be yours, man. Grass chest, Giolana. I see a little bit of power up there. David and my baby boy, the Dara Spot, goes to Kosovo. Aaron's up there as well. We got Amanda and Mansi. Why is it Vietnam with red soil and you thought it was Cambodia? You know, that's still a good call, though, you know? You based your guess off of something, and that's all that matters. Round number five, the final one of GeoGuessr 2069. And we have a license plate on the right-hand side. There's nothing hiding behind me this time. You're just gonna have to trust me. There's grass. And not the illegal kind of grass, mind you. I can put my glasses back on, by the way. Just, I just now realized. Ah, oh, it's better. You're legal. Oh, true, you are the legal kind. I love that. I'm just, there's so many weeds out here, I'm scared of them. <laughs> it's illegal! I'm really trying to read that license plate, it's so hard! I can't make out anything, no detail! <laughs> ah, I hate it. Hmm. Less than a minute remains. No one's gotten it right yet. I guess it'll be up to me. You're not legal, Lynx. You prefer the life on the run from the FBI. <laughs> yeah, you know, why not spice up your life a little bit, right? Not a bad idea. Actually, very bad idea. Don't do that. <laughs> In case you were wondering, don't go on the run from the FBI. You know, it's, it's, uh, 
Live life on the edge. No, don't. Be safe out there! 20 second warning. I'm about to blow your mind, Chad. I'm gonna get this one so right. So right. 10 seconds. A lot of guesses on the board. No one's got me yet. It's the Great Equalizer! The FBI probably doesn't care about a little weed, so if you're on the road, no, but the, the Norwegian FBI does. The n n n The Nuffbaha. They, they definitely care about it a little bit. They do! They'll come for you and put you in, in Norwegian jail! It's the worst! This round makes you need to get your spectacles right. <laughs> really does. Alright, uh, closing the gases. We'll give this one a shot. I've got a feeling, especially going off the license plates, that we're off here somewhere. And I'm gonna go surname. We figured out that that's how you're supposed to pronounce it. Surname right outside of Rizdrik. Rizdrik. Right there. Here we go! Our, well, great. That, you know, I didn't account for Micronesia. I did not. Well done, though, Geo at 1173 kilometers. We've got Pow in second place at 1855, and Lakar in third place at 1869. Nice. DJ Clockwise is up there as well in fourth place. Sophia Lynx, my baby boy. We've got Grass Chest, Man C, Cosmo B, I see Mander, Aaron, myself, Amivio, and my baby boy, David. Thank God this round is over, it's so hard! At least now we all start out on equal footing, as, you know, the question now becomes... DO YOU WANNA GO AGAIN?! I mean, not not this one, though. LaCaro is gonna be your winner right here, let's go! 21,356 points, no, kilometers on this one. Geo Lunner in second and 72, 76, and we've got DJ Clockwise in third and 95, 69, nice! In fourth place, we've got Lynx, Cosmo, B, Sophia, myself, Arzman, Kala, Emivio, Mancy, Aaron, David, Mandra, Pow, Crash Test, and my baby boy, the Darisbot. Let's go! All right, we're gonna do one more, and then I think we're gonna switch it over to some Geo Bingo. What do you think, huh? What do you think, huh? But before we do that, we're gonna lay some groundwork with ACW. Five, two, many rounds. Starts right now and if you want to join in and play with us exclamation mark gc gc as in G wait a i d generate wait finish your sentence finish your thought that sounds like fun here we go though we're gonna start out with this a i d generated world is that a thing that sounds horrifying i want to do it <laughs> <laughs> Here we go, we're loading. I don't know that one, no. I've, I've heard of AI generated, but never AI degenerated. That's cool. Also, genuinely sounds horrifying because it feels like that's where we're headed sometimes. Let me just reload this one. Let me fix it. I'm on the case! Let's go! A wonderful World is also a good map. I love these. I love them. Here we go. It's like 1.6 chance of every official country with islands? That's horrible! I love it. All right, what do we got here? Oh, I'm sorry for the flashbang, Manzi. I'm sorry. At least it'll wake you up. Let's see, the sun is right there to the west of us. Not terribly helpful, if I'm honest, but it's something. What about some cars, huh? Bit of traffic right here. Bit of a traffic jam right here. What do you think? Yeah, this is, this is not great. I'm not gonna, not gonna be getting this one. Vehicles right there parked on the left-hand side of the road? I mean, surely not. Wait, can I see some steering wheels over there? I cannot, I cannot. Is the sun to the south? I see, that's the thing. I'm assuming this is the sun and the compass is pointing straight west. This is a lot of cool old cars. Look at that, though. We've got spruce something. Spruce matter. And also this. Maybe that. It is spruce drive. Nice. 
Nice, I love it. What else? That's some signage. It's on the right-hand side of the road, so disregard my previous. We're driving on the right-hand side right here. Ooh, and that's a school bus right there, isn't it? It's a yellow school bus! I really want one of those. I genuinely do. I think that would be fun. Have you guys ever ridden on a yellow school bus before? Is that a thing people really do? I really wanna. The problem is, the, the older I become, the creepier that dream, you know, would be to fulfill. So, probably not gonna happen. I'm just gonna say that. Time is up, by the way. Two minutes have passed! You never used the school bus? Nice. Are you, are you a bicyclist? Do you, you, you use your bicycle, though? You had red school buses? Nice. I like red. But the yellow ones are so iconic. So, here's the thing. This is a 50-50 between the US and Canada for me. Um, I feel like I've seen yellow school buses in both places, but it's most iconic in the US, and that's where we're gonna go. With these mountains, I'm thinking Montana, right? We're gonna go Montana right here! Here we go! Great Falls. Look at that! DJ Clockwise did it better though at 44 kilometers! Sophia in second at 92 and I'll take third at 281! Pow in fourth place! We got Gio Lana out there, Grass Chest Caro, we got Mancy, Aaron, David, Mander! I see a Mivio there, two links, and my baby boy the Terrace Bot goes to New Zealand this time! It would get checks out. Round number two, here we go! You live two minutes from the school, let's go! Generation 2 camera right here. You can tell by the halo of bad quality above us. A stop sign on the right-hand side of the road. But there's something about the typeface. There's something about the typeface on this one. I don't know if it's going to be helpful, but I think it might be. Something's iffy about it, right? Something's a little bit off. There's something odd about it. Yeah, you're right. Stop! No, this is a Christmas song! Get it out of my face! Better. Better. Alright. What else we got? There's a little bit of a wraparound action to these, uh... The edges of these signs, which I also believe might be a meta. Where's the sun at? I'm gonna assume it's setting over there to the southwest of us. Which means we're in the northern hemisphere, right? North of this line. 50 seconds, no guesses on the board yet! And Mivio's the first one up! Didn't quite get the country, but I'm pretty sure you're close. No one's gotten it yet, this is a hard one, oh no! Call you Crazy Bot, ooh! Hey, Crazy Bot! Do <laughs> you get it? Half a minute remains! I'm not gonna get this one. 20 seconds remaining! Oh, it didn't work out. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Crazy Bot. <laughs> Can I zoom to the southwest near the mountains? Can and will do for you, Geolon, or anything. Do you mean this region? Someone had a joke carrot for breakfast! Yo, you know it, Mancy! <laughs> All right, all right, what's a joke, Carrot? Sounds tasty. All right, here we go, time is up and it is my turn. I'm gonna go all the way out, way out on a limb on this one. Happy butt is the same thing as Gladys. I love it. All right, so, wait a minute! Geo Lunner got it right! And Geo Lunner got it right off of something over here? What, what? All right, so I remember the stop sign typeface matter, right? That should be a Spain thing. Same thing with these, like, lips on the back of signs. I'm just gonna go for it, because I don't know what else. I'll go up here. It sounds funnier in Hungarian? Trefarepa! How is my pronunciation, huh? Let me know. Here we go, let's send it and find out! No, it was Italy! 
How? How is I supposed to know? David is the closest one, though, at 330, no, 431 kilometers. Crash test in a close second at 477, and we've got Pow in third at 615. Giolana is going to be the only one to get it right, though. A round of applause. Welcome to Italy. Oh, they use a quieter looking stop sign. Oh, I remember there being something about the typeface. All right, we've got Giolana Manders out there as well, Caro, Sophia, Mancy, Amivio, Aaron, myself, Lynx, my baby boy, and DJ Clockwise. Right here. It's so difficult. It was mainland Italy. It was right here outside of the, the, the Macarena. So, that was a tricky one. Round number three is coming right up. You think there was water visible as well? Oh, I did not even notice that. You should have been one of the only ones to get it, but you chose to go to San Marino. Oh no, the San Marino trip up. I mean, you're in good company. That's happened a million times. This is another Christmas song. Get it out of my face. Yeah, that's happened a lot of times though. Don't blame your, don't beat yourself up. You know, it's fine. Let's see, what do we got here? Some interesting looking architecture. Red rooftops. Leave the Christmas songs alone? No! I don't wanna! It's April! <laughs> it's April! It's way too early! Why are the license plates reddish? See, I can think of one reason. No antenna on the car? See, now we're asking questions. Yes, there is. And it's beautiful! One minute remains. As long as it's not a bad Christmas. What is a bad Christmas song, though? <laughs> I mean, I don't go shopping a lot in December because I hate the Christmas music, but. There is a red tint to these. You're absolutely right. Going off of this one, though, it's slightly to the left. It's offset a little bit, which is interesting. Is that a priority here? How are you? Happy Saturday. I hope you're doing all right. We are playing a little bit of ACW here today. Welcome. 20 seconds remaining. That's not a lot of time to work. Again, let me know if there's anything else I need to uh, zoom in on. All right, well. 10 seconds remaining, I'm so sorry! I'm so sorry! Oh no, 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 no! I'm sorry, Lynx, it's on me! I'm so sorry! Oh no, not like that! Why is that half a house? It really looks like half a house. It's not my fault, Nancy! I did my best, I'm sorry! I'm so sorry! All right, so if you're wondering, if you're wondering why for, are you wondering why 4 chat right now? That's a rift. It's an artifact you'll only ever find in three countries. Well, that's not strictly true, but mainly in three countries. It's either gonna be Senegal, which I don't think this is. It could be anywhere in Albania or Montenegro. Thing is, Albania has the double blue tags on their vehicles. Or a red tag, you know? You know how Y is only sometimes a vowel? Va vowel? Why was that so hard to say? The UAE is like the Y of the Rift countries. How? I, I don't get it. How so? Oh yeah, no, I get Oh yeah, good point. That is, yeah. That's a good way of looking at it. And you will find that in Lithuania as well, right? The little rifts? No, that's little blurs. I'm gonna go uh, Montenegro because of the lack of double blue tags. Here we go! And it was. It's hard to celebrate that one. On my end, anyway, but we're gonna celebrate Caro getting it right! 20 kilometers away! We've got Sophia in second place at 39, and myself in third. I guess that's, yeah. I'm sorry. Fourth place goes to Geolaner, though. Well done! 64 kilometers away! Estonia, welcome back! How are you? David's up there as well. We got Mansi, Mastros, DJ Clockwise, Grass Chest. I see Lynx there as well. Pow! And Mivio Mander, too! I feel like I ruined that round for a lot of you, and I'm very sorry. I'm very sorry. <laughs> round number four. Here we go! All right, I got this one immediately off of vibes. Let's see. Uh, are we low-count right now? I, hmm. 
assuming this is the blur, I'd say probably, right? A little bit of architecture, never heard any, but that's not true. Architecture has hurt a lot of people, but you know what I mean. Um, we got these ones. You're once in a very small stream, like two people playing, and they guess before you can make your 5k. Oh no, I'm so sorry about that as well. It is tricky sometimes. Zombie, you're heading out. Thank you so much for hanging out and playing with us for a bit. I hope you had some fun. Uh, I hope to see you again later. Have a great weekend. Where's the sun at? Good question. I'd say it seems like it's setting over there. And that looks like the east to me. Where does this... Wait. Is it rising, maybe? Could it be rising? Are we in a country of a rising sun? Could that be the case? Or could, would that be super jubilee? Is this camera special? That's what I was trying to figure out. Like, I don't know if the, this might be blurry right here and over here. In which case, I'd say, yeah. We probably are in a place with a bit of a specialty camera, but it doesn't look like it otherwise. So, I mean, don't strictly take my word for it. And what is this country of a rising sun? I mean, all, all countries get rising sun from time to time, you know? I don't want to... I don't want to spoil it. <laughs> that was nice. I work hard on some of these low-key hints. Oh, no, get that sausage out of me! No, not out of me, you know? <laughs> That's Freudian slip right there. That's on me. All right, well, that... Nope, that... <laughs> Get that sausage out of my face is what I meant to say. Leave me alone. <laughs> 10 seconds remaining. That's no one heard that at all. Didn't happen. We're gonna gloss over that like nothing happened. Sadly, you went to the country, which is a big plus. Oh, I'm sorry, Lynx. I also tried to call out the architecture though, you know? No, get, what is, what even is that thing? What is that thing? The go -cock. get the go out of here. <laughs> Time is up. It is my turn. No, legs. that is the Gokok thing! Get it out of here! No, you're gonna choke! They're choking! Someone help them! Alright, time is up. We are gonna go- No, David Mancy, no! You're- That is a dangerous game you're playing! Alright, I'm gonna go Japan. I'm just gonna straight up go Japan. There is a non-zero chance that it's South Korea. I'm struggling to tell whether or not this is low cam, honestly. But with the architecture... And, uh, that's about it. That's all I've got. Here we go! And it was! Mastros did it best at 94 kilometers. Priority here in second place. Welcome back and welcome to the top of the leaderboard. 104 kilometers away. We've got Joe Lunner up there in third place at 190. Myself too. We got Mancy, Caro, Grasschest, Estonia there as well. David, we got Artie. Welcome back, Artie. Uh, Manda as well, Sophia, DJ Clockwise, and Pow, as well as my baby boy, the Darsbot, going Australia, and maybe Owen Lynx as well. You know, Lynx, that I'll take part of the blame on that one, but at least the, the flag is a big plus, right? That I, I couldn't work it in, I'm sorry. Round number five, here we go. You're doing good, been in Slyco since yesterday, let's go! There, you're there for the Slyco versus New York game in Gaelic football, nice! I've never seen Gaelic football live, uh, but I've been to Slyco, you know? That's amazing! I hope it's gonna be a great trip for you. All right, keep in mind, no spoilers in chat, right? Oh, look, it's the best Geo stream on Twitch. Yes, it's Nat, everybody. Look at that. It's the best Geo streamer on Twitch. Nat, how are you, Nat? I hope you're doing all right, my friend. Good morning. Can you see the sign again? A hundred percent. For you, anything. It looks like this. The best and most hype stream on Twitch. Exactly. Nat is a natural. That's why he's got his name, right? Nat Natural. Did you know that? That's a deep cut knowledge right there. Uh, let's see again. We might be, you know, the car looks pretty big right here. That's, it's a big one. It's a big one. Garbage truck, let's go. I love them. And it has the kilograms on it right there, which could, you know, exclude at least like two countries, which... You thought it was for Natalie? You know, that's the same thing. Naturally. I don't, know, I don't know what I'm doing. It's too early. It's too early for me! Is that an Andy I see? Good morning, Andy. How are you? I missed you. It's been a while. 
20 seconds remaining right here. Natasha, that's a cool name. I like the name Natasha. All right, 15 seconds remaining. This one might be tricky, but we do have some language right here. That's a little man, look at that. He's got his legs right there, the torso and the little arms, and his little head. I like it. All right, time is up, it is my turn. And believe it or not, chat, we are going back to Japan. Again, low cam, you can tell by how much bigger the car looks underneath us. Did I just drop? I think I just dropped. I'm gonna get the phone right away and let people know. It's been a while. It's about once a week now. It, I can't say that it doesn't annoy me, but, you know. Now. We're waiting to reconnect right now. Are we back? No, we're not. Not yet. I'm just gonna sit here and wait. You know, we've got so many guesses. Hopefully, you guys are still able to pick it up again. No, no, no. Come on, reconnect already. I need to see it happen. I was so proud of this one, and it was round number five and everything. Hopefully, we can pick it back up where we left off. Please, 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 please. Are you back? Can you hear me? And, you know, and then. And then it, you know. <sighs> there we go. And then, you know, like 16 inches of a sausage all the way in there. It was horrible. You know? That's why the sausage thing can never be spoken of ever again. All right? It's, it's horrible. Uh, it's a horrible story, you know? 16 inches all the way up there sausages all right so oh we're back let's go welcome back i'm sorry about that chat it sometimes happens i genuinely don't know why i've got a suspicion why but i you know i'll fix it at some point i'm very sorry i'm very very sorry <laughs> no lurky no <laughs> you keep those sausages away from me all right uh, so, technically, the round is already up. Did someone not get their guesses in? Should I reopen it for a bit? Did I give it away? I might have. Well, the, the, all right, so the map kind of... The map might have given it away a little bit! All right, great. That's awesome. Let's see. All right, so... Where do you think it is, chat, huh? Well, um... Wait, don't, are you? No, don't put that in chat, that's illegal, I'll be suspended. I'll be suspended. <laughs> I'm just gonna send a guess right there in the blurge. Here we go. And it was, jump now, goddammit, we're reconnecting now, it's great. We're back up and running. It's gonna be me and the closest one. 144 kilometers away, Andy in a strong second at 146, and we've got Mandra in third at 187. Priority here in fourth place. We've got Grass Chats as well. Ekman, hey, good morning. How are you? Uh, we've got Geo Learner, Mastros, Lynx, DJ Clockwise, Pow, uh, Sophia, Estonia, David, Mansi. I see Carol there as well. My baby boy, the Darisbot, goes to Taiwan. That's pretty close. Well done. Uh, also, Emivio, nicely done, everybody. We're all in that same region. Stream element is bopping people right and left. Oh no, it's a massacre. <laughs> Wait, what did it register as a link? I didn't even see that. Oh, yeah, I have no idea. <laughs> it's kind of broken a little bit, but it is an auto mod, yeah. Oh, oh, the auto mod thing. Oh yeah, yeah, it's the ASCII thing, right? That's do you do you pronounce it ASCII? That sounds kind of dirty, ASCII. All right, we are gonna reveal your winners right here, though. Get excited because your winner is none other than Geolaner. 
at 15.99 kilometers. I'll take second place though at 24.11 and Sophia in third at 24.89. Let's go. Grass just in fourth place. Pow is up there as well. Caro, I see DJ Clockwise on there. Mancy, David, Mandra, Mastros, made in Estonia. I like the alliteration. We got Priority Air up there as well. Lynx, Amevio, Andy, Artie, Aaron, and my baby boy, the Darsbot. You did so well. You did so well. I'm proud of you all. Now, chat, you know what time it is. Do you know what time it is? Do you know? Because I know what time it is. It is time for us to switch over to a little bit of Geo Bingo. I've been promising you that, you know, for weeks. You guys have been asking for it. And I think it's time, all right? Geo Bingo stresses you out? Kind of same. <laughs> kind of same. But you know what? We'll do We'll do a round or two, you know? I'm, I'm here. I'm a people pleaser, you know? I'm a people pleaser. You can't say that I don't people please. All right, so that, uh, if you've never played Geo Bingo before, I'm going to walk you through it all, right? But it'll take me like 30 seconds to set it up. So stick with me. Um, let's see. First time to ride on mobile? I hope it works. You've never played it before, Mastros? It is it is kind of... It can be a little bit stressful, but it's mostly fun. <laughs> Geo Bingo is very harmful for your cardiovascular health. <laughs> Great job selling it, Lurky. I love it. Uh, let me see. I don't. I can't do two things at once. All right. So let me just type it out and, f and fix this real quick. Uh, is it a link? I think it's link, right? And then Geo Bingo. How are you though, chat? I hope you're doing good. All right, here we go. We are about to transfer on over to Geo Bingo. I want you all to, you know, find your chat buddy, hold hands as we move over. I know it can be scary sometimes to change transitions. You know, do you need to register? Nope, you don't. Uh, all you need to do is put an exclamation mark link in chat and you'll be presented with this thing. So the way Geo Bingo works, if you've never seen it before, it's quite easy. Let me update the top bar as well. You know what? We're getting right at the top. No, we're not. We're fixing it. Uh, if you've never seen it before, the way that it works is like this. We'll all... Um, we will all uh, decide on a group of words, like five or ten words or something, uh, items. And then we all go out into the world to try and find those things. I'll show you how it works, don't worry. Is it code? I think both of them work. Let me, let me just update this thing. There we go. And it doesn't, the code thing doesn't work, does it? Code? There you go. You can join the game with the code right there, or you can use the link right there. Those ones. Lynx is definitely Artie's holding hands, buddy. Yep, you made it across. Welcome to Geo Bingo. So, uh, if you've got suggestions or items you'd like to suggest, exclamation mark, suggest, followed by the word, and they'll pop up right up here above me. Uh, things like, for instance, priority air with the ice cream cone, right? That means if we pick this one, which I'm gonna do, you need to go out into the world, try to find an ice cream cone in Google Street View, um, and lock it in. You like Geo Bingo because it's the only app that still has your OG Twitch name. Wait a minute. What is the OG Twitch name then? Is it? Th it's this one, right? 1904 one? Oh yeah, I didn't even notice you added a uh, underscore to it. Let's see, Sand Dunes, I love that one. A USB stick could be tricky. Uh, no, we're not doing that one, David. We're not doing the sauna one. A huge tree, you know, I'm doing that one because I want to see some big trees. It's slightly subject subjective, but I like that. I like to have a couple of, them, a couple of them that are, you know, slightly more off, not not as literal. I'll put myself over here. Let's see, stained glass, oh, stained glass window's a good idea. Domain in the wrong country, that would be so hard, but I like the idea. A flag that does not represent a country, clever one, love it. Uh, 420 and a phone number, let's go for it. And a live fish. All right, we've got our words right here. We'll start out with seven and then we'll see from there, right? So the words, uh, and don't worry, I will show you how this works uh, when we launch, all right? The words you'll be looking for are ice cream cones, sand dunes, 
a huge tree, to a stained glass window, a flag that does not represent a country, four, the number 420 in a phone number, and a live fish. That means if you go for a picture of a fish, that one might not be accepted, right? Do you roll for one country or do we do do we go worldwide? I've never set up a roll. So I think we're going worldwide on this one. Because that the, doing a roll seems like it would take a bit of a setup, which I've never done. I don't do a lot of geo bingo. Mainly because it's kind of me just sitting here talking to myself for about 10 minutes, but it's fine. Uh, all right, here we go. So the way it works, right? You'll have 10 minutes starting right now. You'll see the list of words on the left right here, right? So let's... The, the little Google Street View person is on the lower right-hand side of your screen. Uh, I'll just drop in somewhere random just to show you, right? We'll go Oslo. Where else do you find ice cream? Great. So if I wanted to go for... If I think this is a fish, right? Which I think it might be. Uh, I'll zoom in on it. Click the live fish button. And now it's locked in. Now I can hit the escape button, which is right there. To go back and look for other words. It's that easy, right? It's quite fun. Peter, we always just goes to this random country generated website. That's a good idea. I might have to steal an idea or two from him. I hate stealing stuff off of people, but that is a good idea. But I mean, I do, I do kind of like leaving it open as well because people struggle quite a bit with this as is. This is terrifying. What is this? Why is it just a huge notes with no note with the words get me out of here? This is horrible. I hate it. What? Uh, why? 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 We're in a hotel room. All right. That's actually kind of creepier in a way. That was terrifying. Can I use this for something? It's not a sand dune. It's definitely not a huge tree. Stained glass windows are pretty though. This is not stained glass and it's not a window. I'm really bad at this game. You will you will notice that. I don't have a strategy. I just kind of I just kind of travel the streets looking, you know, to get lucky. That that didn't sound right, but you know what I mean. There's surely a few stains on that window. You know it's a hotel room. Everything is stained. So uh yeah. I think you're right about that. Is this a huge tree? I wouldn't say so. It's a big tree, but it's not huge. I know where to find huge trees, though. I don't know why I picked Oslo, by the way. You've been at that exact place before? Let's go, Lurky! Nice! Me too. <laughs> I stayed at a hotel, which I think might be this one. Right around here, anyway. You find your tree, but it doesn't have Google coverage. Oh, no, Artie, no! Maybe you'll see it uh, from a distance, right? Maybe you'll get lucky that way. Let's see, about seven and a half minutes remaining. Oh, that was the bus terminal. Oh, well, I'm not a local, all right? <laughs> hey, maybe I stayed at the bus terminal. You don't know that. I, I have actually slept uh, in the train station in Oslo when I was uh, moving out to Ireland. I had all of my stuff in one huge bag and I had a long layover. So I was kind of just trying to sleep on a bench in there because there's, you know, I'm not... What else am I gonna do, right? I got woken up by the, the security guards. So rude. I just wanted to sleep. Waiting for my train. This doesn't quite work on mobile. Oh, I'm so sorry, Priority. I really am. That is good information to have, though. Wait, I completely forgot all my words, by the way. When I was moving, yeah, I, uh, I moved over there. 2008? And I lived there until the end of 2009-ish. So a little bit. And I, I packed up everything I had in one big bag. Literally one big bag. It was heavy. <laughs> it was a lot of stuff. I mean, not everything, but you know, the things that I'd need, basically. Which was... A surprising amount of stuff? I'm not finding anything, am I? I'm just, I'm just looking around places. Which is kind of nice. This tree is taller than this building. I'd say that's pretty huge for now. That's good. Um, where'd you f Ooh, wait a minute. I know where to find stained glass windows. See, now we're thinking. Now we're thinking we'll stay in that same neighborhood. Surely this one has a stained glass window to it, right? You're relaxing and looking at dope stores in Czechia? I love that. That's my way to do it. 
it's it might not be the the most clever way to win a game but still this would probably be pretty if it would load in what kinds of uh challenges are you having with the mobile version though priority just like it would be interesting to know because I want to be inclusive with all things that I do, right? And if, if it excludes all the mobile users, that's not great. So it's good information to have. What else? Can, where can I find flags that don't represent a country? Why do I stick to Oslo? I, it's not a great call. You know what? We're moving. We're moving to the Netherlands this time. They've got stained glass and everything. So, it's a good place to be. We're going Arnhem. Arnhem. Arnhem! It's a fun name. I'm here! I'm finally here! What is that? What is that? Is that a live fish? I don't think so. Okay, I need I need to start excluding some things. All right, we'll we'll go for the. What the dog doing? What is that dog doing? I don't know. That is the live fish. Oh shoot! I already zoomed out of it. We're going UAE for the sand dunes. They're known for that in their coverage. I need to start knocking these out. Need to tell you, start taking this seriously. Come on. Do these count as sand dunes though? It's sand. Is there like a specific definition of a dune? I'm guessing there is. I just don't know it. There's some coverage out here. I should not be struggling with this this much. Oh no! Come on, come on, come on. There's some desert coverage down here as well. Wait, there used to be. Now those are dunes! And that might also be a flag that does not represent the country. It's lacking color. I'll use both of them. Why not? There we go. I could be wrong there. Now we need to find a phone number with the number 420 in it. We're going to Washington for that. Downtown. They've got phone numbers downtown, sure. Okay. Yeah, that wasn't a great plonk at all, was it? More downtown. I just now realized that I don't know where downtown is. It's a sprawling city! It's a problem! It's beautiful, though. I like this. This is nice! That's a cafe. <gasps> Wait a minute, they might have stained glass windows over here as well! If I can find a really hipstery place, probably work out for my favor. Only about two and a half minutes remaining, though. Fair warning. Let's see. Yeah, this is not. This is not the run for me, is it? Where am I gonna find a live fish? Hmm. Is that stained glass? It could be. It could have been. That's a cool building, though. It's pretty. Also, ice cream cones. It's so hard to keep all the words in check. That could actually be stained glass right there. I might be onto something. I'd say that's stained glass, right? Yes, it is. Maybe. It's the... It's close enough for now. Fish! Hello? Or phone numbers, you know, anything. I think we need to go to a denser city than this. Four downs. That's technically... No. Czech is a really difficult language, Dad. Yeah. <laughs> God damn it. God damn it! Uh, ooh. Live fish. There might be a fish market in San Francisco that I can use. Wait, hookfish. <gasps> Perfect. They hookfish should have a live fish on display, right? Surely there's a live fish on display. Live fish? 
There could be a live fish. Um, could, what if it's a fish that does a performance live? Would that technically... Would that be good? It's easy for you with the fish. Easy. Oh no, I can't, I can't think of anything. My brain is totally blank. But that's kind of the cool thing about this as well. Because at the end of this, if you've never seen it before, at the end of the game, we're all going to vote uh, on each other's submissions. Uh, and that's when I get to see what you guys chose, which is cool. Because it always blows my mind and I'm always like, oh no, I didn't think of that. Which is always clever. Oh, here we go. Let me just hide the thing because... Your ads! Get them out of here! I don't want them! I don't like that. Another of the major reasons that I don't run this game all that often. I want control of the ads on this channel, not you! All right, so if you find something um, that is definitely NSFW, please um, do mark it as such so we'll, able, we'll be able to keep, you know, doing this. You spent about eight minutes underwater! Oh no, I forgot about the underwater coverage! See what I mean? I totally forgot about that! See, all right. See, now I'm excited though to see what you guys found. So you'll find the little voting things down there. Uh, keep in mind the category. We're starting out with ice cream cones. Is this an ice cream cone? How about aquarium? God, frick, fridge. I forgot it. I, I, I blanked. I, my brain totally, totally blanked. You know a tropicarium? What even is that? That sounds cool. All right, 6% or 66% of the votes right now says yeah. Moving up though, 71 now, we are gonna accept it. Nicely done. What about this one? 100% of the votes, it has been accepted. Ooh, this was a good find, Mancy. Accepted as well. Was that a Tropicarium right there, Mancy? I think I learned the thing now. Ice cream equals Tropicarium. Are they sand dunes? Keep in mind we've switched the uh, category. And the question is, are these sand dunes? So far, 0% of the votes. Unfortunately, that means that there will be no points for that one. What about this one, though? Are these sand dunes? Still zero, huh? Give you a couple of seconds, though. Stained glass windows are in... Wait, are in temp interpreted. Oh, yeah. It's not all stained windows have to be in it. That's true. But you know, it is up to the popular vote. Like right here, only 20% of people says yeah to this one. So unfortunately, there will be no points there. Please be though. Welcome back, please be. How are you? Good evening. Are these sand dunes? 100% of people say yeah. Nicely done. It has been accepted. What about... Ooh, see, this is what I was looking for. This is cool. This is cool. It's so pretty. Nicely done. What about this one? Is this a sand dune? I would say so. It's also a Sarlacc pit, probably. It's terrifying. Well done. What about this one? Ooh, slightly more interpretive, but it looks sandy to me. Like a Windows background, exactly! I love it. 88% of people say yes. Yeah, so we're gonna accept it. Well done. More of a gravel dune, you know. Ah, well. Is, is this a sand dune? So far, 0% of people say no, unfortunately. But it is your first day of playing this as well, right? So it takes a little bit to get into the, the swing of things. Unfortunately, though, there will be no points in this round. But what about this one? Is this a sand dune? It's pretty. I love this. You knew everyone would go with deserts? Oh yeah, Serbian style sand dunes, I love that. And see, that is sometimes uh, the tricky part of this game as well, because it is down to a popular vote at the end. Uh, sometimes it really pays off and other times it can be a little bit risky. But I still love that one. That is a good point though. We do have some sand dunes in Norway too. I didn't think of that. That one has been accepted though. What about this one by Andy? Is this a sand dune? So far, 100% of people say, yeah. It's in West Reddington. Where is that? Let me see it on the map. Ooh, that is cool. 
in New Mexico. Hell yeah. All right, next, that has been accepted for sure. And it's down to this one. Is this a sand dune? Now that I take a closer look at this flag, I think my flag thing might not have worked out in my favor. I now realize there might be something on top of the flag right there. Well, we'll see what you guys think. There we go. What about this one? Is this a sand dune? Was that the White Sands, New Mexico? It was! It definitely was. I don't think that was it, Nancy, you know? Was it? I don't think so. I hope not. Didn't do that on purpose, if that's the case. 100% of people agree on this one, though. What about this one by Aaron? Is this a sand dune? Oh, you've been there, Nat? Nice! It looked really cool. What do you what do you do at like sand dunes and salt lakes and 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 stuff like that? You think it was Saudi Arabia? Oh yeah. There was an image of the Saudi prince. I missed that. Wait, don't they have the green flag with the text in the middle of it? 62% of people agree on this one. It has been accepted. Oh, it wasn't. All right, thank you, Lynx. Thank you. You can snowboard down sand dunes. I've seen that, actually. It looks really fun. Usually you bask in the sun naked. I love doing that. I'm over here now, by the way. Hey. <laughs> what about this? Is this a sand dune right here? Oh, this looks so pretty. I like this. Watch young people try to kill themselves on motorbikes and such. I also like doing that. You know? Only 22% of people on this one. Unfortunately, Lynx, that means there are no points for you in this round. All right, we're switching to huge trees right now. So keep that in mind when you vote. Is this a huge tree? And 100% of people agree. That tree is huge! Nice. What about this one? Is this a huge tree? We did one more mistake. Oh, no, I'm sorry to hear that. Well, we'll, we'll get past it, though. It's fine. That is indeed a huge tree. Nicely done. What about this one? It looks bigger than the charge! There we go. 100% of people on this one. Well done, Artie. That is a point for you. Whoa. All right. This is the... Ar what, what is the word for it? Ar archetypal? It's a massive tree anyway! Nicely done! The, are these redwoods or something? I'm not entirely sure. They're beautiful. I want to see them. I've seen a tree like this where there's they've carved a tunnel out in the middle of the trunk. Tree is still standing. Amazing! Well done. What about this, huh? Is this a huge tree? I think it's pretty big! And 100% of people agree. Let's go! Big tree team! What about whoa? Ooh. See, this one's kind of tricky because you can't tell. Does it grow on top of this thing? Or or is it just a perspective thing? Did Mancy try to trick me? I don't think so. 66% of people agree. We are going to accept it. Isn't every tree huge compared to the average human? Yeah, but I've got a chainsaw. So. You also have trees in the background. True. Tree. True. What about this by DJ Clockwise? I'd say that's pretty big. I mean, it's taller than the sun. How much bigger can you get? <laughs> Nicely done, DJ Clockwise. It has been accepted. We're there again. Look at that thing. It's massive. How does this even happen? You know, it, the canopy isn't that thick. Why would they need to grow this tall? I don't get it. But they're nice looking. Definitely accepted. What about this one though? Is this a huge tree? I would say so, yeah. You were worried about what huge would mean, but luckily you found something that you're sure has to be notable. Let's go. See, yeah, that, that is one of the reasons why I like to have some vague ones as well, because, you know, it's fun sometimes to ha leave it up to a little bit of interpretation. What about this one? It is bigger than the house. I'd say that's pretty big. These are some good ones. They're big indeed. 62% of people agree it has been accepted. What about this one? Is this a huge tree? I like them. I like them all. 
By the way, Grass Chest, you were up pretty early today then, weren't you? I just now realized. That, wow, you were here from the beginning, weren't you? That's amazing. In this trad, all trees are huge! Yes, they are. <laughs> Even this one, it has been accepted. What about this one by priority here? Is this a big tree? <laughs> yes, it is. I like it. We are gonna accept it. Nicely done. Ooh, look at that. Grass chest going big! That might be the biggest one to date. We're gonna meme this and find a Christmas tree ornament? I love that. This is a beautiful Christmas tree. It's the Apostolic Palace in the Vatican City. Let's go! I love that. This is great out of the box thinking. Exactly, that's why I love this game sometimes. I get to see some cool things. This is definitely a huge tree. What about... We're moving over to stained glass windows on this one. Keep in mind, is this a stained glass window right here? This might be the mistake you were talking about. That is totally fine. So far, 0% of people agree. We are going to have to accept it, though. Unfortunately, that means no points in that round. But what about this one? Is this a stained glass window? You didn't find it, but you did find the tree. Let's go! That's... Well done, though. This one is definitely a stained glass window. There are some pretty ones out there, huh? Man, see with one as well in the Matthias Church. I wonder how many churches we're gonna see. I might reward extra points for, you know, out of the box thinking on this one. We'll see. There we go. What about this one? This is a beautiful one. I've never been inside of this one. Give cred bonus points for not going in a church. I shouldn't give myself bonus points. The last time you nearly burned the channel down writing, so I'm not gonna do that. Well done, though, it has been accepted. What about this one? We thought stainless glass windows is a clean win. Oh, see, I see, Artie. Yeah, I should have, uh, I should have made that clear. What about this one, though? This is definitely stained glass. What about this one by Lynx? See, now this one is slightly out of the box. So far, only zero people, zero percent of the people agree that one, fortunately. But I like it. It's nice. We're gonna have to, have to accept it, though. Popular vote and all that. What about this one? A hundred percent of people agree. What about this one? See, I'm not even sure this is stained glass. It could be something behind the glass. But I'll leave it up to you to decide. 90% of people agree. I guess I'll have to take it. I'll take it. I got lucky on this one, though. I got really lucky. There we go. What about this one? I like this. Where is this? The Lund Cathedral. That sounds Swedish to me. I like it. Only 33% of people so far, though. You think intent has something? To yeah, true. That is true. Any glass that isn't white, sparkly clean has been stained true. But I mean, stained glass is a, is a technique in and of itself, right? I think that's what people are looking at. Unfortunately, we're going to have to accept the vote on this one. Only 45% of people agree. I would say, though, I mean, technically these could be stained, but it's hard to see. Unfortunately, DD clockwise, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. But it was a good find. It was a nice cathedral. What about this one? Is this a stained glass window? If you get clothing dirty, then your clothes are stained. True. True. I like your thinking. But if you Google uh, stained glass windows, I'm pretty sure you'll find a Wikipedia article with a uh, whole technique thing behind it. I'm pretty sure. This one as well, 0% of people, unfortunately, Aaron, means there are no points in this one. But we're moving over to flags that do not represent a country. Right here are these flags that don't represent a country. I think so. So far, 60% of people agree. And we're gonna accept it. Well done. What about this one? Wait a minute. Oh yeah, there we go. 
is this a flag that does not represent the country? I feel like I see what you're going for here and I like it. It's these ones, right? Out of the box thinking. Nicely done. Only 14% of the people, though. Unfortunately, that means we're going to have to go with the popular vote. That means there's no points there. What about this one, though? Is this a flag that does not represent a country? Was that the Sex Machine Museum? Oh, no. That was... Oh, could have been scary, that. Oh, I see what you're going for, Mancy. I see what you're going for. Oh, I see! All right, well... What about this one? Vitesse Arnhem? Nice! I don't know what that is. I'm gonna assume it's some sort of tennis club. We're gonna accept the vote though. Nicely done. What about this one? It is indeed. A hundred percent of people agree. Totally Yanis and not football. See, I didn't know that. What about this one? Is this a flag that does not represent a country? Leaving it up to the popular vote. I mean, I don't know sports ball. I don't know sports ball at all. You might have misinterpreted. Yeah, that's totally fine. That happens. We are going to have to go with the popular vote, though. Only 20% of people agree. What about this one? See, this one I'm unsure of, so I'll give you some time to deliberate. Because I feel like the background definitely does represent a country, but, you know, the, there's something in front of it. And I don't know what. Genuinely don't. 80% of people agree? All right. We're going to go ahead and accept it. It was the same one as my Desert Doom thing, Sand Doom thing. What about this one? Is this a flag that does not represent a country? I, oh, I see what you mean on this one, Artie. Oh yeah, you went for the wrong country flag. That is somehow a lot more impressive, though. That is genuinely a lot more impressive. I like that. But unfortunately, only 20% of people agree we're gonna have to accept the vote. But I think you did well. That is a hard task to find. What about this one? Is this a flag that does not represent a country? I don't know this one, so I would say probably. But I don't know all the flags. What is this, huh? 100% of people agree. Every embassy, yeah, that's a good point. That's a ghost! Oh no! Oh no, there they are, it's fine. All right, good. We're moving over to light fish, by the way. We're not looking for flags anymore. That was flags and stained glass in one pick. Let's go. That was impressive. It was impressive. Are these live fish? Yes, and they ate the whole top half of this person. Oh, no. We're going to accept the vote. Well done, Andy. What about... See, these are the ones that I forgot about. I don't know how. I love these ones. But I forgot about them. Grass chest didn't though. Well done. A hundred percent of people agree. <laughs> oh, look at that thing. That's a shark. We should get out of here. He's so big. We're going to accept the vote. Please be well done. What about these ones? Are these live fish? I'd say so. We are going to accept that vote. Well done. What about these ones? These are, uh... The ones from Finding Nemo, right? Clownfish? What the dog doing? I don't know, pal! He's swimming! He's swimming! What was the flag category? So there were flags that did not represent a country. Which was a tricky one. Well done, we have been voting on this one and it's been accepted. What about this one? Definitely a live fish. Nicely done. You spent eight minutes looking for fish and completely forgot fish? Wait. So enjoy Fort St. Catharines in Bermuda. That sounds nice, Lynx. Please let me have it. Send me there. Look at that. I think that's a shark right there. It is indeed a live fish. Well done, priority here. That was a cool one. What about this one? Is this a live fish? I'd say so. I love these tunnels, by the way. I've only ever been in one of them. Wait, Sen almost had a heart attack once. He turned around the underwater coverage and there was 
A really big shark right there? No. Ah! That's a big shark right there! It's scary! Yo, no! Ah! See, I can also be doing stuff like that. It's, yeah. I get it. I got jump scared by a big kitty cat once, though. It's in the... It's in the clips. Literally. It genuinely scared me. That's not acting, Mander! That was real un... un... un bridled fear. My seat is not dry right now. That's how scared I was. There we go. We're moving over to... No, it's still live fish. Oh. So this is Fort St. Catharines. Is this a live fish? Little turd, good morning. How are you? I hope you're doing all right. Happy Saturday. Welcome to Saturday. We've missed you, little turd. Saturday hasn't been the same without you, but now you're here. Is this a live fish? Uh, unfortunately, no one agrees. Fort St. Catherine is an island, and that's different. Matsy's gonna be your winner! Please be, though, matching the score as does Pow! We've got Earn Joe out there, myself, Mander, DJ Clockwise, David, Andy, Langsam, if your priority here, Grass Trans and Artie! And Aaron Joe now with the biggest beard in the channel, ripping it off of the face of Mansi! Nice. Alright, Jack, do you wanna go again? I've got time for one more if you guys wanna. It's up to you, though. We can go again if you wanna. And maybe it wants to go again. David does as well. That is exactly what we'll do. And if you wanna join in and play with us, exclamation mark link in chat. That was on you for a long time. It was, Mansi. It's been growing and festering and it's kinda grungy, but it's fine. So, I'm gonna clear out these suggestions, and if you have any suggestions you would like to suggest, exclamation mark suggest. Someone said this is a tense game, you agree? It is a little bit tense, right? I just, I, I gotta sit here and, and talk and look, and I don't know how you guys do it. You leave for the airport in three hours? Let's go, little turd! Running around like a two-headed chicken with a, with both its hands cut off. Oh, no! Those are my favorite chickens. You just realized Go is misspelled in my emote? Wait. Oh, <laughs> I get it now. I get it now. I get it. All right. This, these are the words right here. I'm not doing that one, David! No! Get it out of here! <laughs> Unrealistic places. I like the idea of it. What types of places, though? Places you've seen in your dreams! That's cool! You know what? That's just... That could be anything, but I still like it. I, I want one of them to be, like, all the way out there. We're doing that one. I like it. Uh, life before... That's cool. All right, yeah. Pac-Man or a Pac-Man shaped object! Grass chest amazing! A guitar, we're doing that one as well. Yo, Carol, how are you? Happy Saturday! Also, welcome back! Should we do... Yeah, we should do at least one more, right? An island. Or, let's see, the number 16. I like those, but we just had the 421, right? But the anywhere thing helps. I feel like these ones might be a little bit too tricky, and we have the uh, the place you've seen in your dreams as well, right? I don't know what I would put there. I don't dream a lot. It is a little bit vague. That's true. Is it too vague? Is it a bit too vague? What do we think? A giant version or model of a small item? That's clever. We're doing that one. Definitely. All right. Any country-specific stuff? For a harder round? What would that mean? What, 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 how, how do you, uh, what, what, what do you, what do you mean, huh? What do you mean, huh? Like, like, should we do it in a specific country, do you mean? Or more of a, uh, country-specific item? Because I can, I can narrow it down. Like, you can actually do restricting regions to, like, yes. Yes, but which one? Yes to what? <laughs> All right, great. So. Uh, these, I think these are the words that we'll be sticking with. Uh, a place you've seen in your dreams, that one is highly subjective. You know? Peter uses the URL random.country. Should we do that? We could, we could do that. Let me, let me pull one up. 
I'm always scared of can I do that off screen and you guys trust me? I'm just I'm 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 wary of new I'm wary of new websites in this browser. I don't trust Chrome at all. I don't trust Chrome further than I can throw it. Ah, right, this looks fine. Yep, that's what we're gonna do. We're doing a random country one. This is cool. I feel like I'm stealing it off of uh what do you mean, flashbang? What do you mean, flashbang? Oh, it's me. I'm getting flashbanged. Owies. Yep, these screens are big. Random dot country. We're gonna pick a random country right here. And we are gonna restrict it. The random country is gonna be... Belgium. We have coverage in Belgium, so that's fine. Ooh, this is gonna get hard real quick. We'll try it, though. Hopefully, Peter e doesn't yell at me for stealing his way of doing things. But, 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 but Peter is a good guy, right? That'll be fine. Like that. Did I select this one? Did I do it right? I feel like I did it right. Let's try that because it's a whole new... It's a whole new feature, right? You'll have to sit out and not a problem, Lynx. Have a good one. No, no, someone call the police in Norway! No! Don't call the Nifabi! The Nifubi, you're gonna get me! Sitting out? Oh, I'm sorry. All right, well, here we go. 10 minutes on the clock! And it has been restricted to Belgium. We gotta try it, right? Oh, I, I get you, grass dressed. I get it. All right, yeah, no. That's, I mean, people are free to, you know. We gotta try out some new content from time to time as well, right? It can't always be the same thing. Lola, good morning! How are you? Happy Saturday. We just got underway with a new round of Geo Bingo. If you wanna, if you wanna join in and play with us, it is a tricky one. Some of them are quite tricky. How am I gonna find a guitar in Belgium? They don't play guitars in Belgium. Oh no! I just now realized. Ah, it's fine. It is fine. David and Mansi already finding stuff. How? Huh? How? Huh? I'm just gonna look around and hope to find things. You're awake, let's go, Lola. I'm glad to hear that. I'm doing good as well. It is Saturday. Uh, it's been a good day so far. Having some fun, you know? Ow, that is a very bright web page. Get that out of my face. Uh, but yeah. You know, and it'll be a fairly busy weekend this weekend, but busy can be good, right? see what we got. There's some... I really am struggling with remembering the words. I really am. Let's see. I mean, th an outdoor venue would be great. Live performance or act could be a lot of different things as well, right? Like, this person is performing as someone who's addicted to their phone. It's a interpretive dance. But it's a thing, so I could pick that if I wanted to. I'm not gonna, but I could. Let's see. And if you've never played Geo Bingo before, by the way, the way that it works is like this. Um, let's say I think this is a live performance, right? He's, he's trying to mimic the silhouette, for instance, right? I zoom in on it, and then I click the corresponding button or, or word like that. It's now locked in and I can hit the escape button to go back, look other places. We are restricted to Belgium though, keep in mind. But other than that, it's that easy. So no need to know meta or anything like that. You just kind of drop in, look around, try to find any of these words that you see on the left hand side right there, right? If I can find a music store, there would be a great chance of finding both a busker, maybe. Ooh, buskers, good idea. And a guitar. At the same time. Are you are you busking or traveling? No, they're gone! Oh no. <laughs> they're gone. I scared them away. Buskers are skittish. We know that. You gotta approach them gingerly. 
something Pac-Man shaped would be kind of cool to find. That's one of those where, oh, you know what? That C is kind of Pac-Man shaped a little bit. I'll use that for now. See? Think it outside the box! I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Belgium is such a beautiful country. It really is. Look at this. Look at this architecture, right? I've been to Belgium once. I'd like to go back. I really would. And I just kind of traveled through it. But... Imagine actually staying there, looking around. I don't even think I was in a major city like this. It would be kind of cool to do. They don't like their buskers out here, though, or any sort of live performance. I mean, look at this thing, though. Look at this! Beautiful. Five and a half minutes remaining in this round. Quite a few words, apparently, on the board on the right-hand side there. You guys are doing better than me, I'm pretty sure. Is that a giant version or model of a small item? I mean... Puppies are pro normally quite a lot smaller than that. It'll be my stand-in for now. <laughs> Hopefully it works. It's hard, but yeah, it is hard. But I mean, that's why we play this as well, right? Sometimes it's fun. Sometimes it's hard. That's life. Let's try keep looking around. Live performance or act, where else would we find that? It would be right here! This would be the perfect place! <sighs> Anything? Guitars? Anyone? They don't play guitars in Belgium, apparently. You're just eating! <laughs> That's not okay. Wait, how am I gonna find a place that I've seen in my dreams in Belgium? I never dream of Belgium! We should start- I didn't think that one true. That's on me. Well, that's fine. It is not the end of the world. Oh, I'm back here. All right, cool. Uh, four minutes remaining right here. No, oh, no. But at least, like, you guys might be able to think outside of the box on that one. I'm excited to see what you'll come up with. You saw a castle for sale in Belgium and you dreamt it? Let's go! See, how am I gonna... I, I mean, I can't disqualify you off of that. Because I don't know, I don't read all of your dreams, right? I've, I've only read most of them, Marty, all right? I don't know every single dream you have, just the naughty ones. So I'm not sure how I'm supposed to control that, but it's fun to, uh, you know, have some open categories sometimes. We get, we get to see some cool places. And I like that. That's an L. Is that an owl? That's an owl. Huh. How is there not a single person playing an instrument anywhere? These are perfect places for that. You know, there's a lot of foot traffic. I guess Belgians just hate money. And guitars. Today I learned... Ooh, that looks good. Uh, oh, I want it in my mouth right now! Technically, has that been in my dreams? It probably has at some point. Huh. Are you guys struggling with any of these? I'm definitely struggling with them. No street artists, no street performers at all? So hard. Huh. You found zero of them? Ah, oh, no, that's tricky. It really is. Alright, what else? I don't want to see anyone performing in, in there. That would not be great. That's a little stage right there, though. Is street performance illegal in Belgium? Apparently! This is so hard! Why? I mean... 
I don't think I've ever had to search this long for a person with a guitar or anything like that in weather like this. I mean, this could be... This could be co coverage from the middle of uh, COVID, though. Which could impact, you know, some things. And I don't want to start zooming in on the unhoused and things like that, right? That would be... That wouldn't be a great look for me. So, not doing that. Hopefully there's just a good old person with a guitar. That would give me two for one, and I would be happy with that. Being from the Netherlands kind of helps with this one. Nice! That's amazing. I'm excited to see what you come up with. Are you playing? You're, no, you're not playing anything at all! Half a minute remains. You've done it, Lex! Did you get every single one? Are you kidding me? That's amazing. You're so good at this. All in one place! Nicely done! Alright, well, at least it was doable. I just can't wrap my head around it. I, have no, I haven't seen a single guitar. It's confirmed. Belgium hates guitars! The worst part is, I already have a love-hate relationship with Belgium. I mean, mm, not really, but... The jokingly, I do. Alright. Oh, come on! Get away from me with your ads! F*** off! Alright. There we go. Skipping the ad. And we're starting this thing. So, now we're moving over to the... Uh, the voting phase, right? You gotta vote down there. As to whether or not people have found the category that you're lo uh, looking for. I have a love-love relationship with Estonia! You're right, Nat! I do have a love-love relationship with Estonia. Dreams can be anything true. I mean, I didn't want to just do a cop-out for that one. Uh, like always, by the way, if you find any uh, not-safe-for-work images, please feel free to mark them as not-safe-for-work. Otherwise, you know, I will get banned. And then I'll be angry. Alright, this is the first one up. Places you've seen in your dreams. This is amazing, David! Guy, I need to start reading your dreams more. That's cool. 100% of people agree. These are going to be some free points, though. A couple of free points. What about this one? Has Mansi seen this in his dreams? I'd say so. Where is this? This doesn't look like... Alright, I've never seen the Belgian coastline, I just realized. That's cool! It has been accepted. Well done. Whoa, this does look dreamy, Caro. This is cool! You know what? You nailed the entire atmosphere. I'm gonna... I'm gonna grant you the extra point for that. Because this looks like it's actually in a dream. It's got the little puppies. But it's not the middle of Christmas, probably. Well done. Definitely accepted. What about this one? Has almost seen this one in their dreams. I think so. That's a lot of flags right here. I know some of them. You know? There's Poland. Switzerland, Sweden, there's a lot of them. Awesome, all right. It has been accepted, well done. You've seen this in your nightmares? What, you mean fun with flags? What about this one for links? I, I can believe this one 100%. Well done, is this a place you wanna go or is it a place that you've been and you'd like to go back? It has been accepted. What about- Oh no, grass chest! I hate it! This is so- This gives me liminal space vibes. It really does. It's got that dream vibe to it. I'm getting- I'm, I'm doing the extra point. We're keeping with the, uh... This is terrifying. You're getting the extra point. Well done. What about this one? Oh no, this is even worse! This is terrifying! Please be- Are you okay? No. No, that's- No, that's- That looks so scary! What is this? The Atomium. Take me to the Atomium, please. In Brussels. That was amazing. Look at that thing! I love that. Well done. Please be extra point goes out to Australia. What about this? Is this a place you've seen in your dreams? <gasps> the Netherlands! Look at that! That's clever thinking, Pow. I love that one. Nicely done. I have seen the Netherlands in my dreams, too. It has been accepted. What about this one by Miss Lola? Oh, this looks so nice. 
You love DJ ones too? Oh uh, yeah. Wait, which one was that? I'm, I'm trying to remember. I can't remember all of them. This one has been accepted. This is so nice. I wanna, I wanna go there. Oh, I haven't seen it yet. All right, cool. This one. Why? I don't get it. But I'm gonna assume it's the same train of thought. And I support you. It has been accepted. Standard leash? I don't like the standard. I want the... I can't remember what the word superlative is. There we go. Well done. We're moving over to live performances right here. Moving over to live performances. Is this a live performance or an act? And I definitely see what you're going for. This is one of those contentious ones, right? Where some people clearly think, you know, it counts. Others don't because it's on a... It's on a thing. Which... I mean, I'll give you a couple of seconds to make up your mind. It's 50-50 right now. So I don't want to be the deciding vote. Because if I accept it at 50, it means that it doesn't... Oh, 58. We're going to accept it. We're going to be kind to each other. Ooh, look at this. By Pow right here. Who's this, though? Who is this? It looks like a Rammstein set or something. It is definitely a live performance or an act. Can we figure out where we're at? I don't recognize you. Who is that? Rock Verster, big festival, let's go! I wanna go there. I wanna go, it has been accepted. What about this one? Is this a live performance or an act? How did you find this? This is cool, grass chest, nicely done. It has been accepted. Is this the same one? It looks like the same one! Nicely done, David, definitely accepted. Now, this one. Is th this is kinda... Wait, this is an interview and a whole thing. What is this? What is this? I like it. It has been accepted. This had to be extremely hard. Right, I think, yeah. I mean, I was just strolling around looking for anyone with a guitar. You guys went all out. Look at this. Nicely done, Lynx. Definitely a live performance. What about this? Is this a live performance or an act? A hundred percent of people agree. This is beautiful. Can I just take a second to look around? Wow. Holy, look at this. I don't know why I'd be terrified to sit underneath this thing. I, d I, I would expect this to fall. I've seen movies. I would not want to sit in this section. Worst part is that's probably the best section to be in. All right, well, it has been accepted. What about this one? We're moving over to Pac-Man or Pac-Man shaped objects. I went out on a limb on this one already. <laughs> don't, don't judge me. <laughs> Wait a minute, 90% of people agree! All right, I'll take it. I'll take it. What about this one? Is this a Pac-Man shaped object? 42% of people right now, we're close. I think I see what you're going for. But we're gonna have to go with the popular vote on this one, unfortunately. Pac-Man is just anything circle while well, he's a circle with a little slice uh, taken out of it, right? It's got the waka waka thing. Waka waka waka. <laughs> you thought about posting a yellow rigid circle as a Pac-Man shape? I technically, I mean, I, I would, I would accept that. Only 11% of people agree on this one. I see what you're going for, though. I like this one. The whole opening, I'm guessing, right here is the Pac-Man part. But we're gonna have to go with the popular vote. Unfortunately, that means no points for you on this one. Unless I'm missing something. I don't think so. <laughs> I like the little statue, though. Oh, it's the same one! Oh, yeah, it's the guitar thing. Is this a guitar? Yes, it is. We can speed run these ones, right? That is a guitar. Well done. That is the same one? Wait. Oh, it isn't. All right, cool. Uh, <laughs> this one is a guitar. Nicely done. What about this one? It's a guitar. Your giant eye didn't seem to be slightly contentious. That's fine. What is this? All right, I'm going to need your guys' input. I do not know what this is. Is this a guitar? I love it. That's a hurdy-gurdy. Is that what they look like? 
I love the way they sound. I don't think I've ever seen them not being held. That's cool. We're gonna have to go with the popular vote though. 55% of people agree. We are gonna accept it. Well done, almost. Hurdy-gurdy might be a type of guitar. I don't know. Casual Moth, hey! It is a hurdy-gurdy. I love the hurdy-gurdies. I've heard them in a couple of, uh, in a couple of, uh, songs, you know? They're cool. What about this one? Is this a guitar? Yes, and it's pink. I love it. It has been accepted. All right, we're moving over to giant versions or models of small items. What about this one? I definitely see what you're going for there, Grass Dressed. We're gonna accept it, I will say, though. Oh, yeah, it's because the globes are small. I was thinking the Earth. See, oh, you, yeah. You duked me on that one. Well done, and it's been accepted. What about this one by almost? If you buy a globe, it's not gonna be this big. Yeah, but if you buy the Earth, you're gonna be in trouble. So, <laughs> what about this one? Is this a giant model of a small item? 88% of people agree, and we are gonna accept it. Well done. Pow, look at that! It's this one again! I love this one. I kinda wanna climb it. A little bit. It has been accepted. This, you know what? Extra point for this one. Extra point for that one, Pow. Well done! It is the smallest. Well, it isn't the smallest, but it's among the smallest. I'll see it four times. Let's go! Well, I've already locked in the extra point then, so it means all of you get those extra points. What about this one? Is this a giant version of a small item? I mean, yeah. That's a baby. They are small items. That doesn't sound right. They're small. They're small. <laughs> Yo, Morgoon, how are you? Happy Saturday. I hope you're doing all right. Here we go. We are going to accept this one. Well done. What about this one? This, see, this one I can't decide. It looks bigger than your normal line or puppy or whatever, you know. Also, Morgan, I did... Okay, it's gone now, but that, that emote is illegal! You don't use that emote here! This one is accepted. This game is chaotic. It is chaotic. It can be a little bit chaotic. It can also be quite a lot of fun. Is this a giant version or a model of a small item? I would say so. I mean, quite literally, too. Look at that. That's a giant version of this one. That's clever. Is it clever enough? Because it's got a bit of a double entendre to it, you know? Double entendre. I know French. We're going to give you the extra point. Well done, Lynx. It has been accepted. What about this one? Is this a giant version? Or a model of a small item? Yeah? Well, technically, it's the other way around, right? What's that, sir? Or am I wrong? Man, see, that was the biggest bit in the channel, ripping it off of the face of Aaron Joe. You gave me the, you gave me the giant version of a Sammy and a giant version of that giant version. Exactly, I love that. Well done, that's the big boy sub, exactly. I love me the big boy subs. All right, here we go. The next one up is gonna be this one. Is this a giant version of a small item? Uh, that we technically just did that window, Amivio. Yo, that Radakuni D! Thank you for the follow, I appreciate that. Welcome, welcome, happy Saturday. What about this one? This has been accepted as well with 91% of the votes. It has been accepted. What's this one again? Well, I, I did kind of already do the extra points, but I gotta do it for all of them. The Radakunity. Can you join? Absolutely! Exclamation mark link. We are in the voting phase right now. Uh, but I think we might do another one after this. Uh, since I gave the extra points for these ones before, we're gonna do it again. Hey, Yuki! Welcome back! Happy Saturday! It has been accepted, and we're gonna go to the scores. Your winner's gonna be... It's Lynx! Shared with power right here, though. Five points apiece. Well done. Caro's up there as well. We got almost Crash Just, please feed David, DJ Clockwise, Mancy, Lola, myself, Yuki, Aaron, Andy, Mander, RT, and Amivio, as well as Priority here. Well done. You got an extra point and didn't use the statue? Nicely done. All right, we are going to go again. If you've never played this game before, the way that it works, let me just clear out the suggestions. There we go. 
And I'm gonna set up a poll meanwhile. Exclamation mark, suggest if you wanna suggest a word. We're gonna do a poll, since it seems contentious. Uh, do we restrict the region? It's gonna be a yes or no thing. I'll set it to two minutes, cast your votes. Do you want to restrict the regions? Or not? Rainbow colored reflections. That is a tricky one. No, David, we're not adding the sauna. We, there's no sauna thing anywhere. That's not, we're not doing that. That is not a thing we'll do. A blue house, love it. Love it. The dream one we just did as well. So we're not, uh, we're not doing it doubled up. A flag, I like it, but it might be a little bit too easy. I mean, we, you know what? I'm gonna add it because it is easy. And there is a chance that we will see some cool ones. All right. We do need some easy ones, yeah. We really do. Some birds, uh, well, we already have the flag one. It might be a couple too easy ones then, you know? Should we have more easy ones? What do you think? But I need more suggestions though. So exclamation mark suggest to add words if you want to. Yo, Tomcat coming in with the raid! Hey, Tomcat and everybody, welcome. Happy Saturday. How was stream today, Tomcat? How was stream today? All right, Amivio, take it down a notch, all right? That is an official warning. Take it down a, wa take it down a notch. How are you all doing? I hope you're doing all right. If there's anybody in here right now who is not currently following Tomcat, please go ahead and hit that follow button at the top of your chat screen right now. I promise you, you will not regret it. Tomcat played a lot of uh, the, a lot of the. You did play this game last weekend, didn't you? I seem to remember that. How is Geo Bingo? It's been good so far. We're just setting up another round, so if you guys want to join in, exclamation mark. Link. It's Link, isn't it? <gasps> Stop there. Oh, or did I did I do... I, I tomcatted it, didn't I? Oh, no! Get it away from me! I literally can't reach it. Oh, thank you for cancelling that. Woo! That was not what I... See, Tomcat, what I mean? That's... Yep. Also done that. Did I just cancel the vote as well? I, it was literally covering the thing. I couldn't cancel the raid. It was terrifying. But there you go. There's the shout out for Tomcat. Hit the follow button at the top of your screen if you if you haven't already. Uh, exclamation mark suggests to bring up some words. I'm going to pick a couple. Uh, that was a good point about the flags, though. We could go back to the previous ones. But I still like it. Pro streamer. Literally not, Mancy. <laughs> literally not. Let me read through these. We've got animals. That's a, I like that one. We've got large spherical things. I like it. I'm keeping an eye on that one. We're not doing sauna. No, we're not! Any usual Google car or truck? The Embassy of Norway. That one might be a little bit too easy. Wait, we've got several embassies, don't we? Maybe. Writing that isn't in English. That's clever. You know what? Yes. I like that one. Towers. Absolutely. I love to see some cool towers. A single ladder by itself. That's clever. I love it. Funny places of street view. Technically, we've seen a lot of those off of those uh, maps on GeoGuessr, but I'm up for some funny, sure. And we will add some animals. Why not? I like animals. We'll see some animals. Are we ready? These are the words words we'll be searching for. It'll be a blue house, with a, not necessarily with a smiley face on the house, but look for blue houses. Uh, a flag can be anything. Writing that isn't in English, right? Doesn't mean that it couldn't be uh, Roman lettering? Latin, but God damn it, I forgot which is which. Uh, towers. Any type of tower. A single letter by itself. Funny places of street view. Or animals. That one is a broad category. So you can pick whichever ones you like. You've got 10 minutes to search. I... How did the, uh... The poll go? Do we restrict it or not? Overwhelming majority says no. All right, we'll do World Mr. Worldwide right here! Exclamation mark link to join in. That 10-minute timer starts right now. 
Is Embassy of Norway an Embassy of Norway or an Embassy in Norway? I did not, did, we did not that one, did we? No, we did not. We did not. So if you've never seen, um, if you've never seen how this game works before, I, I'm sorry, I, I got thrown off there a little bit. Uh, if you've never seen how this game works before, uh, it's like this, right? You'll see the list of words on the left. I'll just drop into a random place just to show you, right? Let's go right there. I'm looking for a blue house, for instance. So let's say I thought this was a blue house. I'll zoom in on it, click the blue house button, and now I can hit the escape button and look for the other words. It is literally that easy. You don't know to need to know meta or anything. It's all about just going out there, trying to find some, some funny things, you know? How many people do you think are gonna go for the uh, Leaning Tower? I think there's gonna be more than one, but I'm here for it. I like it. We're go, we'll go, ah, no, there's not enough coverage over there. Where, where could I look? You know what, Madrid, it's been a while since we've been to Madrid. See, this is my strategy. I just kind of drop into places um, and just hope to find the things that I'm supposed to be finding. These are red houses. That's different. But I could probably quite easily find language that isn't English. Funnily enough, that one technically wouldn't count, so I'm uh, not right. <laughs> Can I find an animal right here, though? Technically, all humans are animals. But here's the thing as well. I could choose this puppy statue right here. But since we are voting for the words at the end of the round... That could be a little bit risky, right? Even though I think I'd accept it, I don't know if you guys are. So I'm gonna choose to not pick that one. Because I want the... The surefire points, right? I'm pretty sure you guys are gonna blow my mind with the blue house one. Pretty sure. There's probably some famous blue houses that I can't even think of right now. But we'll find out. That's the fun of it. This is autumnal. In the middle of Madrid? Huh. Alright, let's focus in on some things that are easy to start with. That's weirdly enough also English. Great. Uh, <laughs> for sake. See, this technically isn't. Restaurante is not a writing in English. I'll do it. Perfect. Now. What else? The funny places one is going to be difficult for me. Uh, if you played a lot of that map on GeoGuessr, it might be easier, right? Because there are a couple of actually quite funny ones. I'm just gonna hope to find something that's kind of funny. These are animals, and I'm gonna pick them. Now I need to find a single letter by itself, a blue house. Which I thought that was it. Hmm. Tricky one, this. Anything? Uh is that technically a blue building? It's got blue details on it, but it's not a blue house. Huh. Hmm. We got loads of time. We're not even halfway yet. I'd be curious to know what your guys' strategy is for this, though. I'm guessing there's a few different ones, right? Some of you might have an Excel sheet with clever things on it. Other might, others might just go about it blindly like I'm doing. All right, we'll, we'll try a different town. Blue houses. I know Japan has a lot of blue roofs. Maybe that's the play. We'll give that a shot. Please, anything. Oh, and I also need to find a flag. I forgot about that. Blue houses? Is it Smurf? Well, it could be. It could be. 
yeah, it wasn't supposed to be this hard. But you see what I mean about the blue roofs, though? They're everywhere in Japan. But I don't think they've got a lot of, like, actual blue houses. There's white ones in Greece. Where else? Oh, you know what? I'm, I'm all over the place right now, but I'm doing it anyway. Uh, you I feel like you find a lot of colorful houses in the Americas. We're going to Mexico. Let's see what we can find. Yeah. Drone shot. Probably not your best bet on this one. Let's zoom in a little bit. We'll go outside of Mexico City because I think there's where you'll find the most amount of generation four. You're done already, Mansi! You still got four minutes. How did you find it? Was it too hard, too easy? Hurry up. I'm not Mr. Sona, Mansi! That's not me! That's not my name! That's not my name! <laughs> That's a greenhouse. Let's see what else we can find. Is Pepsi okay? Hmm. Not even a single letter by itself. Wait a minute. There is a single letter by itself, kinda. If I can find that sign by itself, I'd be golden. I feel like this one's a little bit too low hanging. That's kinda. How am I gonna pass this, huh? We didn't. All right. Great. Not a blue house either. It's got blue details to it. This is kind of hard, isn't it? I'm excited to see what you found, though, Mansi. Where would I find this Smurfville, huh? No one ever asks about the welfare of Coca-Cola. <laughs> All the restaurants you went, you visit, just ask if Pepsi's okay. <laughs> God damn it, that's clever. I love it. I hope Coke is doing all right, though. This is a blue house. I'm okay with that. It is in my mind, anyway. Now I need to find... How have I not found a tower yet? And I've got two and a half minutes to do so. Also a flag. And a single letter by itself. But I, I was on the right track over here. I feel like there's that sign with an E on it. If I can find that, I'd be good. Why are there none of them? Pick a different different area of Mexico. That's a kitchen. And I'm probably not gonna find any of those things in there. It's a pretty funny place though. Hmm. We'll do it again. We'll do it until it works out in my favor. Here we go. Blue bus? No. Tower? No. Flags? No. <gasps> no. Oh, no, I might not even be able to find a single flag on this one. Huh. That's gonna cost me points. Surely there's a flag over here. You fly your Mexican flags. There's the E. There it is. That's the one I was looking for. And I found it. It's by itself. It is illegal, though. Just keep in mind. No, man, see, it's illegal. What did I just say? You're not allowed to put E's in chat. How have I not found a flag yet? There's a minute left. No, oh, that, that one's fine, Adam. You're, you're good. That, that one's fine. That one is totally fine. I just want to see the E's right there because it's posted on the street, right? And we got to be careful so we don't break the law. Is this a tower? I'm just going to mark it. Who knows? Wait, that's a better tower. <gasps> I found the gold mine of towers! There's so many towers! It's a church tower, right? Technically, it's on the night. But there are no flags. Why? They're normally so good at posting flags everywhere. F is just an amputated E. Yeah, but the rules specifically stated that E's are illegal. And I don't want to be arrested while I'm traveling around Mexico. You know, it would be, wouldn't be a great end to my day. We, we gotta respect the local laws when we travel. You're done, Casual Moth. Nicely done with a half a minute to spare. I'm still struggling to find a flag in a funny place. What if I found a flag in a funny place? Huh? No, that would get me banned. But... No flags anywhere definitely can't be the US. You know... 
You're not wrong. God damn it. Here comes the ad again. Get it out of my face! All right, we're gonna go again. You got all but one? Which one did you struggle with? How did you find that? Was it all right? All right, we're gonna move through this. Again, if you've never played Geo Bingo, you'll find the little voting thing right down there. Uh, keep in mind the category. We're starting out with a blue house. All right, and if you find anything that is uh, not safe for work, please feel free to mark them as such. Are you ready? Here we go. Is this a blue house? Yes, it is! Bendy, nicely done! That was how? Did you just randomly... Someone secretly watching basketball? I don't know sports! You kind of cheated clockwise. I'm excited to see it. You know, play smart. No, not a problem. Here we go. We've got 6528 right here. Is this a blue house? Yes, it is. Well done. I feel, I've got a feeling you also found some writing that's not English right there. Nice. What about this one by Lola? I would say so. A nice one. And a nice house at that. What about this one by Grass Chest? <gasps> See, now you're thinking, yeah, there's a lot of blue houses out there for some reason. Yo, sweet, how are you? Good evening. Well, actually, good morning to you, though, right? No, it is good evening now, isn't it? What time is it? It would be good evening for you, yeah. Good evening, sweet. These are all very blue houses. Yes, there are several of them. I think this one's technically teal, but still. All of your locations are very far north, let's go. See, I'm inferring by this that you like the cold. Is this a blue house? Yes, it is. Nicely done, it has been accepted. Ooh, clockwise, I love this one. You said you cheated? I th I'd say you thought outside the box. Depending on the popular vote on this one, there might be an extra point in it for you. I love this. You're tying all the different ones together. What is this tower? It looks familiar. Is that like Taiwan or something? Not entirely sure. It looks nice. Ooh, it's 50 feet. No, you stop that right now! You stop doing that right now! I don't know who you are! I don't know who you are! <laughs> is that a tiny Eiffel Tower too? It is! Look at it! It's Taipei 101! That's why it looks familiar. I'm giving you the extra point. There we go. Nice. All right. Is this a blue tiny? Is this a blue house? That's not right. Why? It seemed right to me. It seemed right in my mind. Taipei like your blood? What? God, that's that's a pun. And I like it. Well done, Adam. All right. This is also a blue house. Well done. We're accepting it. As ooh. Not everyone agrees. I, I struggled with this one a little bit, but the majority agrees, and we are gonna accept it. Oh, it is. Oh, it didn't sound right. Oh, must be me. What is that supposed to mean, Ned? That's rude. <laughs> what about this one? Oh, I love this one. Did it make you feel some type of way? Taipei, wait, god damn it, it's hard. Can we ban DJ Clockwise for that pun? I'd ban him twice if I could. Honestly. <laughs> Definitely accepted, Caro. Well done. Welcome to Probable Legoland. Ooh, look at this one by Mancy. It's beautiful. It's got all kinds of shades of blue on it. Fifty Shades of Blue, the sequel. The sequel no one knew they wanted. It has been accepted. Well done. What about this one? This is indeed 100% a blue house. There we go. DJ Clockwise has been banned forever. Oh, but they're back! What is this magic? Fifty Shades of Blue. Smurfette's next adventure. No, no, ah, -uh. no, ah. -uh. We're not. No, that is not. We're not going down that road. That I don't want to think of the implication there. I hate it. Gargamel. All right, this one's been accepted. Well done, Lynx. A blue house yard. Wait, was it? Did I skip past one? I might have. Is this a blue house by David right here? Right now, only 38% of people agree. Unfortunately, that means we are going to have to go. Wait, did I miss yours, Lynx? I did not. Wait, wait, wait. I'm going back. You guys feel free to go on without me. Wait, is... Wait, Yuki's one is accepted. That one's, that one's good. Lynx's. 
Blue Halcyon! No! You know what? I would consider the extra point on this one. The thing is, I've got a feeling that one could be Googled. I'm not saying you did. I'm not saying you did. I'm saying it could be done. So if I start doling out extra points for that, I mean, the league would be in shambles, right? But it is well done. I mean, I trust you. You know what? It's Saturday. We're kind. I'm going to give you the extra point links, all right? But it's just because I love you, all right? You... Ooh, I love you, legs! There we go. An extra point for you. Well done. What about this one, though? David, not been accepted, unfortunately, by the popular vote. Only 42% of people agree that this is a blue house. What about this one, though? By Clover right here. Clover with a little heart on it. I love it. This is definitely a blue house. Well done, Clover. Wait, would you believe it's in a district called Wood Green? I, uh... Would not. There we go. We're moving over to the flag category right there. Are these flags? So far, 88% of people agree. And we are going to accept it. Well done, 6528. What about these ones? Yes, they are. Well done, Caro. Definite flags right there. What about this one? Yes, it is. Well done, David. See, you're all going to your home turps right here, and I love it. What about this one? Yes, it is. Well done, Mancy. It has been accepted. What about these ones? There we go. Nicely done, almost. It has been accepted. What about these ones? Minus points for the Swedish flags. Trust me, if I could, I would. But I don't think I've got that power. Unfortunately, uh, Yuki right here as well. Accepted 100%. Nicely done. What about this one? Lola, 100%. I like the uh, the name of the ship there too. Like it. Like it. What about this one? Let's go! The US of A. Welcome to New Jersey. Oh, it's New Jersey. Never mind. All right, we're accepting it anyway. There we go. Are these flags? Yes, they are. Is this the last round? Yep. I've got a plan. Uh, I gotta head out after this. So this is the last one I've got time for, unfortunately, but we will be doing more in the future. What about this one? Clockwise. Yes, it is. It is a flag. You did it well. You can't believe you couldn't find the Faroe East flag in the Faroe Islands? Really? What did I struggle to find something in the Faroe Islands recently as well? What was that? I genuinely can't remember. I struggled to find a cowboy hat in Texas, though. Can you believe that? <laughs> These are also flags. Well done, Lynx. Beautifully done. What about this one? Welcome to America, Washington. Nicely done, the Washington Monument. Beautifully done, please be. It has been accepted. The Blue House idea was yours, so you knew where that was too. Nicely done, Lynx. See, I never, I never said I didn't trust you, right? It's just, it sets a precedent. It sets a precedent, and that's kind of scary, but that's fine. This one's been accepted as well. Well done. What about this one? By Clover. What is this? What type of flag is this? I like the color. Nice. 100% of people agree. That is indeed a flag. We're moving over to writing that isn't in English. Keep in mind, it didn't say not in a Roman Latin alphabet. But this definitely counts. Well done. That, I believe, is an M. I, hmm. Yeah, do, do you see? This script is tricky. But uh, I'm going to leave it. I it's, I struggle with this. All right. But here we go. Well done. DJ Clockwise right here. Is this writing that isn't in English? I would say so. That looks like stinky, smelly Swedish to me. We are going to accept it. Well done. What about the... Ooh, definitely. Got a bit of Cyrillic right here. Well done, Geo Learner. It has been accepted. What about this one, huh? Also accepted. Wait, when I see your writing, you'll you'll know which tower you went? I'm excited to see it. <laughs> Nicely done, Mancy. This has been accepted. Swedish isn't stinky. I can smell it from here, casual moth. <laughs> Grass chest. Ooh, this is cool. Wait. Oh, yeah, it's that. It's the... Um, I can never remember the name of this language, but it's cool looking. I love it. You know what? I'm giving you the extra point for that one. 
Inuktitut. Inuktitut? Did I get it? I think I got it. Nicely done. You're getting an extra point off of that. It is such a unique looking language. It warrants the extra point. Nicely done. What about this one? This is definitely writing that isn't in English. Beautifully done. Accepted. What about this? Letterhouse. Why should I let her house, huh? I hardly knew her. That bad joke right there for you. It's Saturday, though. You gotta accept it. 100% of people agree, though. Nicely done, pal. What about this one? I do believe so. That doesn't look like English to me. Well done, Amivio. It has been accepted. What about this? Carol, huh? This one's interesting. See? This is kind of like, uh... No, I'm not gonna say that. That would come off as super offensive. But this is a Norwegian brand store chain. But it, this is in Denmark. It's smelly. You can smell it. It's Denmark. But it's definitely text writing that isn't in English. Well done, Caro! It has been accepted. That was an amazing joke, Well, I'm glad you liked it. What about this one? I didn't spend too much time on this one. I, I'll leave it up to you. I don't think restaurante is English, though. Do you guys want to go to a restaurante with me? I'm all the way over here now. I keep forgetting. But it's fine. Did 70% of people of you want to go with me? Yeah, I'm alright with that. You guys pick up the tab, though. It has been accepted. What about this one? By links. See, this one's supposed to tell me which tower you went for but i don't know any of these this isn't even a tower that's a boob what well, that's not a tower that's just a stool but we are gonna go ahead and accept it well done lynx what about this huh clover going for it it might be a little bit hard to, s to see but 100 percent of people agree well done you want pizza let's go you guys are all Pizza shit is what? All right. I'm sorry. It's a little bit of an outburst right there on Saturday. It's fine. This one has been accepted. Well done. No, you don't. No, don't. Don't you. Don't even give me that, Joe Lauder. You, you know I had to do it to him. What about this one, huh? It's a cool one. I like it. Please be well done. It has been accepted. What about this? Wait a minute, this is Swedish again, isn't it? Ah, it's Swedish again. Let me just do this. All right, here we go. It has been accepted, though. This is not... Ugh. Let's just do that. Oh, it's a bike shop. Let's go. <laughs> what about this, huh? Definitely looks like writing. That is in English to me. It has been accepted. What is the... Why does this look scary a little bit? Huh? What is it, huh? Why is it see-through? Is this... Oh, I see what you did there. All right, it has been accepted. Nice find. Nicely done. What about this? We're moving over to towers now. And I asked before all of this, right? How many people do we think went for the Leaning Tower of Pizza? We've got one. We should put up a counter. I don't have a counter ready. But man, see, this is definitely a tower. Well done, it has been accepted. What about this one? See, I like this one, David. It looks nice. It's not a tower, it's an abomination. <laughs> I love that. You're not wrong. I wouldn't stay there overnight if you paid me. I would. I would. But I wouldn't feel safe. You hope someone will show a water tower in the US? I hope so too, Artie. Those are cool. I've never been on top of one. This one's been accepted though with 100% of the vote. What is this? That's, that looks cool. Is this modern or old? I can't decide. It looks like it's both from like the 1500s and the 2020s. At the same time, 100% of people agree. Nicely done, a good find. What about this one by almost? Definitely a tower. A hundred percent of people agree. You tried to go to the Tower of London, but you didn't think it would be ac accepted? I see that, yep. That is the gamble. It's a gamble, but I would have, I would have, I would have liked you for that. Your friend's mom worked on, st wait, stopping the Leaning Tower of Pizza? 
from just freaking collapsing? What, did she did she go there and take a photo holding it up like this? That's she did that, didn't she? I salute her for her service. She did well. We are gonna go ahead and accept this one. Well done! Oh there it is again! Third time we're going! Let me I wanna I, I need to do this, alright? You don't you you're not allowed to judge me for this, alright? Take my picture. So, uh, yep. Well done, Geolana, it has been accepted. And no Eiffel Tower yet, that is a good point. Is this the fourth time running now? It doesn't look as crooked on this, from this side. Wait, this is a different one, isn't it? I think this might be a different one. Is it not? I don't know for sure. I don't know for sure. What about this one, it has been accepted. There it is again. It's the same one. Please be nicely done. It has been accepted. What about the, ooh, this one's cool. I love this. Thinking outside the, this is amazing. What is this thing even? It's a mechanical pig. I love it. I want it in my house. Garden, probably. I couldn't fit this in my house. This is, where are we right now, Radicoon D? I need to figure that out right now. Ransom Canyon. That didn't help at all. We're outside of Lubbock. It still doesn't help. We're here in New Man. Now, wait a minute. <gasps> There's, uh, the music stopped. Give me a second. D d uh, give me a second before the very reasonable freak out. Guys, we're in Texas. The loads are staying. It happened. Let's go. Yeah. What the dog doing? But what is the... You know, he's just standing there menacingly. I don't know for sure. But we are going to have to go with the popular vote, though. And only 23% of people agree. Unfortunately, that means you get no points. But you get extra credulous points for a cool tower. I love it. It has been accepted. What about this one? Is this a tower? 100% of people agree on this one. It has been accepted. Oh, this is a cool one. 6528, I don't know where this is, but we can find out. It is the, where to go? It is the Torre de Bellem. Sounds kind of rude, but we'll accept it. Well done. Ooh, this one, there we go, Lola, well done. I've seen this one before, that's cool. And it has, you guessed it, been accepted. I, where'd my, there we go. There's a nice pointer. Well done. What about this one? Ooh, DJ Clockwise pulling out all the stops on this one too. Not only did you find the tower, you found the highest tower in the world. Look at how tall that is. That's amazing. 100% of people agree too. You did well. Nicely done. What about this? There we go. What is that? The sixth time running. I like it though. We are going to accept it, of course. What? If, ooh, this one's cool. What is this? Where are we? That looks Icelandic or Faroese. It is Icelandic. Let's go. That's a cool find. I want to go up there. Imagine the views. It has been accepted. What about this one by Clover in? This is definitely in uh, uh, Faroe Islands, right? I recognize the name. I've been there. I don't recognize the sites though, but it looks nice. It has been accepted. It's kind of the most famous abdominal tower in the world. What's an abdominal tower? I'm not asking to be funny. Genuinely, what is an abdominal tower? I want to know. I want to learn. What about this one? I'm not so sure, but we're going to go with the popular vote. 80. Nope. Yep. 80% of people agree. And I'm going to accept it. 75% of people agree. And I'm probably still going to accept it. it we, do we know for sure, though, what's under there, right? We, you can't know for sure. I'm going to accept it. There we go. What about this one by Pow? I'd say so. A hundred percent of people. Nicely done. What about this? 75% of people right now. Moving up to 77. Can I see an 80? 
It's the Jetsons' house. Is it really? I love that. An abdominal tower, one that causes pain in the stomach just looking at it. I love that. You know, yes. I can't even imagine. Like, I kind of got that even just in Vegas. Wait, the previous one was... <laughs> what? Do you mean the... the what? You don't... You won't allow the Jetsons to live here, huh? I don't appreciate that. The Jetsons can live wherever they want, but also here. You're right. That's cool. All right. These two are both accepted. Yuki's up next. We are going over to a single letters by themselves. And how did I not think of this one? Well done, Yuki. That is indeed a single letter by itself. Looking to mingle. The next one is this one. Ooh, this one's cool as well. I love it. It has definitely been accepted. What about this one? I mean, yeah, it's a P. Hey, Lynx. I see you, P. I see your P. It didn't work. Leave it. Leave it. I'll fix it in post. It's been accepted. Nicely done. What about this one? Ooh, this one. I see what you're going. I, you, ooh, I love this one. I kind of love this one. See, because I definitely see what you're going for here. The problem is... Popular vote. Don't agree. But I like it. It kind of... It looks like you're saying, you know... Please have this... Oh, thing right there. I love that. We're gonna have to go with the popular vote, though. It's hovering around 33%. I'm sorry. But I respect it. The next one up is this. There it is! That is a single letter by itself, pal! Nicely done! No, no! Link speed and chat again! Can I get a clean up and I'll chat? Mods, clean up and I'll chat! Why did I not think of the McDonald's logo? That's so clever, Mancy! I forgot about the lot. No, David did it as well. Can I, can I get a clean up and chat over? Th oh, it's all the way over there. It's fine. All right. Accepting this one as well. Nicely done, Mancy! What about- Ooh, this one's clever, Clover. This one's Clover, Clever. I like it. Again, I love this. These th these are definitely letters by themselves, but you also kind of nailed it with this one. <laughs> Nicely done. 100% of people agree. We are gonna accept it. What about this? Same place. Same time. Different sign. We are gonna accept it, though. Well done! What about this one? That's a P. Again, nicely done. Definitely accepted. Not as good of a sign. I mean, it had some other information on it. Now, the question is, are you going to accept this one? Because, I mean, technically that's an E. Uh, but also, it's technically kind of not supposed to be there. But 72% of people agree! I'm going to accept it! I'll take my points. No, man, see, you're not allowed to put E's in chat! What did you just... Oh, wait, we technically, we moved over to here, which is in Sweden. Sweden is a lawless hellscape. Everything's allowed here, so you can definitely put E's in chat. It's fine. Uh, there's a C right there. It is by itself. It has been accepted. DJ Clockwise, nicely done. What about the... What is going on here? Oh, yeah, we're moving over to funny places. I did not catch what was going on there for a second. This, yeah... I mean, this is highly subjective, right? I think that looks pretty funny. Also a little bit, what the hell? But that is fine. No, casual mop, that is an illegal emote over there! What are you doing over there on the other side of the screen, huh? You... What? what is, no, it's gone now. I didn't quite... All right, that seemed like you were doing something legal. Karos has been accepted. What about this one? That, I like it! I love Star Trek. Live long and prosper. Right? Freaking nailed it. 100% of people agree, though. This is a funny place of Street View. <laughs> Nicely done, almost. What about this one? 0% of people, huh? I mean, it looks really nice. I would like to go here. I love it. It looks nice. And it's got this whole thing going. That is kind of terrifying. <laughs> Only 7% of people agree, though. We're gonna have to go with the popular vote. Unfortunately, that means no points in this one. But it looked nice. What is this? Not truly street view? I mean, yeah, but we gotta be kind. We gotta be kind to each other, Lynx. Please be 100% of the votes on this one. What is this? 
Unless your street is 500 miles in the air. Where we're going, we don't need streets! We're accepting this one. What about the- Oh no, what is that? What is all of this? What is going- There's a lot of things going on in this picture! That's a circus though, that's technically a funny place, you know? See, that's thinking outside the box. I like that. Yeah, I could have gone for a comedy club. God damn it. Well done, man. See, I'm giving you the extra point. Frick's sake. What's, what the dog doing, huh? Hey, what the dog doing? This is going to be the last one, yeah. I've got some plans afterwards that I need to tend to. Uh, but we're definitely doing more Geo Bingo in the future. What is this? I love it. I need there. I feel like there's a story here though. Sharknado! No, that's not a good explanation. You're just making up words now, Mancy. We're accepting the vote. Well done! What was that? What is this? I don't like this at all! Wait, but it, what? Where are we? What is going? What is this? I mean, I get the. What happened here? What is this, huh? 63% of people agree! And we are in the middle of Legoland, though. Nicely done. Alright, we're just waiting for one of you to make up your mind. We are... Yep. Wait, did that actually get accepted? I need this one to be accepted. It was plus, and then you guys are doing some... So you're playing the f games right now! Stop it! You stop that right now! I'm accepting it. There we go. It has been accepted. Ooh, look at this, a corn maze. I've never been to a corn maze before. Have you guys been to a corn maze before? Are they tricky? They seem kind of tricky. Only about 30% of people agree though. What are we thinking? Moving up to 40 now. Moving up to 40 now. It seems like the majority even up. Uh, Accounting for the Frick Frick games. It seems like it's still not considered a funny place, unfortunately, pal. We are gonna have to accept the vote. There we go. What about this one? Is this a funny place? That's a funny looking one. I don't know what's going on. It's at the North Pole in Alaska! I love that! I just now noticed that. That's cool. You were doing the my schedule moth. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. All right. Uh, no, wait. What happened? Why was it removed? Oh, it was removed because it didn't get accepted. I'm sorry. Let me let me fix that for you. Everybody, we're going to wait for casual moth, all right? Grab a good book. It could take a while. You know casual moth. You know what they're like. Uh, this is a... Uh, it could take a while, all right? So, everybody, we're just... Uh, so, um... You read any good books lately? <laughs> Alright, we're moving on. <laughs> well done, though. We are gonna go ahead and accept this one as well. Unfortunately, the popular vote does not agree. Only 26% or 28% of people think a McDonald's on the North Pole in Alaska is funny. I think that's pretty funny, though. Here we go. We're accepting the vote. There we go. We're moving over to animals now. Keep in mind the category. And the candy cane, I know, I liked it. I would have voted yes, grass chest, I promise. What's the dog doing? What is the dog doing? He's going for a walk. 80% of people agree this is an animal. I, f I feel like, man, so you kind of you kind of centered the picture on, on these people. Any, uh, any reason for that at all? That's, you know, the dog near the pizza tower. Oh. Oh yeah, look at that. That's the tower. The leaning tower is right there. Nicely done, Nancy. We're accepting it. What about these? Oh no, no, no! Please be no! What that dog doing, huh? He better stay down there. Better stay down there. I don't like him. My best friend is coming up. Is this the one? Is this my best friend? I don't know if I want to get to know him. We are accepting it though. 100% an animal. What about this one? There are these animals. What are we thinking? What are we thinking? I'll leave this up to the popular vote again. 11% of people agree, unfortunately. That means there's no point there for you. I'm sorry. 
I mean, there's more than likely animals in there somewhere, right? But when you when you see it, you see it when you see it. I saw it a couple of days ago. I'm excited. What is this? What genuinely? What kind of animal is that? Is that a tiger? No, that's a. What are? What are you? What are you? Huh? Kind of hard to tell. Caro with 100% of the vote, though. They're definitely animals. Oh, they're bears. That's why. Oh, yeah. A person is an animal. Yep, that is the uh, that's the one I mean, though. It is a risky one. Ah! Over here. What is that? No, I don't like it. 100% of people agree. Right. We're getting out of there. Fancy, no, now I can't see. What are you? That's a big chicken. That is a big chicken. We are definitely gonna accept this one. Ooh, look at them, they're cute! I love them! I want one! So are these like with the, uh, you know with the, the ducks in the park, right? You can kind of just go and pick them up and they're free? Would it be the same thing with one of these guys? Can I just go there and pick them up? A hundred percent of people agree though! Geo Lunner, nicely done! I love them. What about this one, huh? They're the same ones, they're basically the same ones. <laughs> 90% of people agree. What do you mean 90% of people? They're definitely animals. All right, we're accepting it. <laughs> what is going on here? What, they're flying rats? Yeah, but rats are animals, Pat. What do you mean? <laughs> there we go. All right. We are accepting this one 100%. Only one midway. Oh, no. No, they're back. They're back. No, the horsies. The horsies are back. Get away from me. No, 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 no. All right. 100% of people agree on this one. They're, they're kind of cute, I guess. But they're so big. They're so big. Wow, they want to eat me. They're going to eat me. I'm scared. I'm just a tiny boy. And these guys are big. We did see the I do remember these ones actually. We're accepting that one. Well done, Yuki. Good brain juice. I, well, well use of brain. Nicely brained, Yuki. Are these animals though? I dare say so myself. A hundred percent of people are with me and agree. He just wanted to say hi, but he was coming at me threateningly. I, he was. I don't know. I don't trust him. What are you? That's a puppy. It's a water puppy. 100% of people agree on this one as well. Well done, Bandy. We're gonna accept it. Oh, look at these legs with the tall boy meta. I love it. I mean, I'm technically, I, I don't. I got bit by a giraffe once, chat. They're bastards. That's what they are. You're all bastards. Get away from me. Yeah, you go in there. You go in there right now and be ashamed. Yep. You hang your head. It's going to be a long, long hang. We're going to accept the vote, though. Well done. What about these ones, huh? I genuinely don't know what these are. Are they horses? No. Are they boars? I don't know what they are. Look at that hand. Interesting. 100% of people, though, agree. Well done. Pow! What about this one? A hundred percent of people agree. It's a little kitty cat. And we're gonna accept it. What about this one, huh? Also, a little kitty cat. We're gonna accept it. And here we go. Your winner is DJ Clockwise. I didn't realize it was the end of the round already. A round of applause right there. Nicely done. Mancy Lynx almost. We got 6528 up there as well. Grass Chest, Karo, Yuki, Jill Lanner, myself, Clover, please be Bendy, Lola, David, Pow, and Mevia. We got that right. That, oh, I, I keep struggling at the beginning. I promise I will learn your names. All of them. The Radicunity. And I don't have my glasses on. Well done, Aaron there as well. Andy, Mander, Artie, and Priority here. Nicely done, all of you. All right. You guys know what time it is, all right? That's right. I'm over here now, by the way. I, I've said that many a time. And, nope. That was... Did not mean to... That's not... Uh, that's... All right. Everything is out of order. All right. It is time for me, chat, to end stream for today. Please do stick around for the raid, though, if you would. I would super appreciate that. You know? 
Uh, and I hope you had some fun. You know, we don't we don't do a lot of geo. What's the dog doing? What is the geo dog doing? He's ending stream, David. And we're gonna do that with a quick hydrate, though. Quick one, super quick. Everybody, we're heading into the weekend well hydrated. Grab the closest thing you've got to a liquid and have a sip room with me. This one goes out to you, David. Cheers. Here we go. Yo, Eric, I'm sorry. Yeah, you came in at the uh, tail end right there. But don't you worry. We are going to be back. We're going to do some more stuff. All right. Uh, but I do have some things that I need to take care of right now. Don't even worry your pretty little minds, though, because I'm going to leave you in some very capable hands right here. Because we're going over and saying hello to none other than the amazingly beautiful, soft-handed, super, super kind Nat. All right, you know him as a mod over here. You might also know him as a streamer. We're gonna use a different raid message today, though. We are gonna use this one. That is the raid message we're going with today, all right? So pick up that one. You can use the other ones as well, but that one is definitely the one we're using. Trust me, he loves it. It's absolutely true. Uh, he's doing a 12 hour raid, or 12 hour stream today as well. So I'm gonna be in and out of there. Um, I do have a DMD thing tonight though, so we'll see when. But still. A 12 hour raid? No, it's a 12 hour stream. It is a 12 hour stream! Until then, chat, I will be back on again tomorrow at 11 o'clock Norway time. I will leave you in the very capable and soft and explorative hands of Nat. You guys are beautiful. I'll see you again. Bye bye. <laughs>